Donald. I'm like trying to like increase the scale a little bit. Yeah, no, they're just getting okay. No, we're not gonna. Yeah, I'm trying to improve with my C Sasuke scale, and so like, I'm gonna eat some food. Good. Yeah, what should I go eat? We know you need some food. You've been sitting up in the trees for too long, Carrie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, what should I eat? Ooh, ah, ooh, ah, shut up. <laughs> All right, what should I eat? <laughs> Someone give me a fucking food suggestion. Um, banana. Wait, wait, carrot. You know, avocado grows on tree. Avocados are so gross. It's nice, bro. Avocados is nice. I started I started part two. Like I'm like twenty chapters in part two. The clock. I should be talking about all the day. Fuck you, bitch. Yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up, Kyle. You fucking little brat. Shut up, Kyle. You fucking little brat. Oh, sorry. Uh, I like you it's, like, it's like quite right, the piece. Hey guys, be respectful. Guys. Come on. Bro, Godly, why are you talking? Shut up. I'll buy some. Like, no one cares. Hey. Come on, what a dog set right now. Hell. Hmm. Yo, guys, be respectful. Come on. We're all people. <laughs> Not you, Kevin. <laughs> Alright. Shut right, the fuck right, up, right, you bitch. No, no, actually, actually, actually. Alright. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Devo. Here. Yeah. Yeah, you agree to like Sasuke scales to like, like prelims Lee, right? Like the weightless Lee from Gara fight. No, I, I say he scales to like Giddy Lee. He scales to Gate. No, I'm talking about speed first. No, I say he scales like generally above Lee. But like gated Lee and speed. Yeah, and speed. Why? Because um he shows just better feats. And he stayed as Gara's strongest opponent. Does he show opponent. higher speed feats than gated Lee? And he stayed as Gara's strongest opponent. <laughs> Yeah, why is that referring to a speed? Because when they say strong in Naruto, it can refer to speed and overall stats and just like it, it can, has to be specified. It can refer to like a, it can refer to like jutsu speed. It can refer to a couple different things. Why in this case? Well, we see like Naruto. I'm gonna show it where Naruto like calls Lee strong, right? And he's referring back to the fight where he was fighting um Sasuke. So obviously, like strong isn't just contained to just meaning like, uh, like. Sp like yeah, I'm not saying like it only instances. like in all cases it has to be. I'm asking you like why in this specific case is it overall stats? Because nothing contradicts it. What makes him slower? What? Well, he's just stated to be at weightlessly level. Well, he stated to like be about, which he could be like higher than. Okay, and then like weightlessly can also like tell it's like lead. stated to be a huge difference between base and fifth gate lead. So, so about wouldn't include fifth gate. And no, I'm also saying that it would also include like uh gated because weightless weightless includes gated as like a technique you can use. What but God doesn't consider them to be like the same level and Lee also states that like, Sasuke's on his level, like like the level that he had trained years to get. Does he, he say specifically years just base? Because then he trained for gates. Uh -huh. Yeah, but not for years. He he starts he off, like he, he learns the forward lotus like during this year because we see him like we see his like him unlocking the forward lotus he has his bull cut. So why would I he be has, like, about, like everything he's uniform. trained for up to this point that like uh, no that, but that's not, he just states that like he states that Sasuke's reached the level of train like the reached level of speed that it took me years to get. Okay, so he why would take that years to get like the gate gate level of speed and the other things right? Why would it not be why, like if I say it took me years to get to this point of speed right with training? It could be something like recent, but that's a like that's part of the years. Right? Like, why is it a separation if he's not making No, I don't think, because Lee literally got that, Lee got the gates the same year. Okay, so he's been training the move. He would have to have been training the move, right? You can, like, I can unlock it, I can no, actually I don't, have I don't even know if, like, I gates is something, like, like, are you talking about, like, continuously using it? No, I'm saying, basically what I'm um, trying to make is that Lee could have been training for the gates and not have the ability to use it. And like just recently, now he can actually like use the gates after training for it for this period of time. So, so if I like unlock, if I like, unlock something like ten minutes ago, am I gonna like include that as something that took me years to get? Yeah, because have you not been training to unlock what? the move that you like? I, I don't think that. that yeah, training? but then he gives like he gives an amount of time that he would reference it. Okay, and I'm saying a part of that, like his training, would have to logically include things like the gate and the loaded. No, yeah, He's it could be a part. It could be a part of training. Yes, he has to train the gates. Yes. But I don't think that's what's referenced via the context of it saying the train, like the speed that it took him years to get. The speed okay. that took him years to get is what he shows, like in his base. That's well, why I disagree. It I think took it would years to like get that techniques. level of speed. It didn't take years to get the gates, right? He didn't it, it instantly a different lock it, amount right? of time. Are you saying Lee totally just trained same. in that like one year and got it? Yeah, yeah, we literally see him get. He, he unlocks the forward. <laughs> okay, obviously he has to unlock the forward Lotus first, right? Okay. So he unlocks the forward lotus. Like, we literally see guys say when Lee unlocks the forward lotus, right? Because they have a flashback to it. Lee has the bowl cut. 
We know a year ago when he first joins Guy's team, he doesn't have the same haircut or the same outfit. And they're only a year ahead of these current line of Guinea. Wait, so are you so saying he just Lee never had... trained for the gates? Like, I'm asking you that, right? No, I'm not saying he doesn't train them, but I'm saying it takes a different amount of time than what he gains, like, his actual base speed. And what I'm saying is my interpretation is that Lee is making a statement on his overall, like, everything he's trained for up to this point. Okay, and what I'm saying is, like, that these two things would be viewed differently, right? Because while, yes, he does train to get that, he doesn't train for years to get that. While he does specifically train years to get to where he's at now in terms of his like current level of speed, like his base. So you don't think speed. he has to train on like like the four at Lotus? You think he just like did it? That's not what I'm. That's not what I'm saying. Yeah. Okay. So I'm saying like he trained to get to this point. We could use things like the four at Lotus and the gates. It took training yes, to get to that. Yes, but point. I'm saying that he specifically trained years to get his base level of speed. And what I'm saying that's is what he specifically trained years to get. He never. He doesn't train years to get the four at Lotus. So you don't wait. So what I'm saying is, right, is that to get the four lotus, he needed to train. Yes, but only it doesn't for like make a any sense. He, he didn't just get it. That's what I'm saying. He has to train. Yes, yeah, but work only up for his a couple months at Mac. I'm saying there's a huge difference in in the amount of time it takes for him to get these two different techniques or these two different. I disagree. Levels I think him unlocking the technique was recent, but him training to get the ability to unlock it would still be a part of it. Like, it would still include that. Okay, but that wouldn't be that level of speed. To be able to use gates isn't the level, like, Bye. that isn't the gates level of speed. We're referring to what level of speed he's referring to. So, the ability to get gates isn't the gates level of speed. So, that wouldn't help your point. So, you're saying training your physical body wouldn't help your speed and training your body wouldn't help I'm saying that that isn't no specifically gates. the speed that he holds within the gates because the gates is an ant. I'm not that he trains I'm, I'm, I'm agreeing with you that that he is referencing the training that he does up until the point or for like to unlock the gates. I'm agreeing with that. I don't okay. agree that it's specifically the speed of the gates. And I'm saying that Gar's statement lets us know that he would have to be greater than the gates. Because what other aspect well, I don't agree in this specific hold on, you just said that like, hold on. When I ask you why like what fits the interpretation that it is referencing speed here, you just said there's no contradiction. Yeah, there's no contradiction to it, and you already okay, you can't make the strong. positive just because there's no like just because you. No, what I'm saying is you already agreed that strong in Naruto can mean general stats, and I showed proof. Yeah, that. strong in Naruto, yeah, strong anywhere can mean general stats. Okay, then. I'm asking so why it does it here? So I'm giving it a problem. All you're giving me is a way? possibility. No, I'm giving a proper. Inter I'm giving an interpretation. Substantial. Yeah, that's just a possibility. And so is yours. I haven't given you. I haven't given you a stance yet. I'm, I'm just asking why is yours the case? Because you can't just assign me a possibility and like literally nothing to back it up. I gave evidence to back it up. No, you just said that it's a possibility within the series for it to be that definition. No, I backed up why strong would be referring to all stats, and I didn't back up Lee's statement no, and why said, we're referring yeah, to like his overall. You're reading why strong can be referring to all stats is me agreeing. And then I that also we be like are stats. literally just speaking on the lead point. And I explained that too. Uh, okay, I think we're like, I think there's like, I think we're like misunderstanding the difference between possible and probable. I'm asking you why something would be the case. You're telling me some, why something can be the case. It would be the case based off the evidence I provided. All you provide me is that possible cool to be faster. All you provided me is that po that stronger or that speed can be encompassed and faster. So and then also what I was saying about Lee's statement to referring to like his, um, so his then I ask you why specifically in this statement. Is it included in faster? And then we go back to, well, you've already, like, basically I've agreed that stronger can mean faster. It goes back in the same circle. There's no reason why it is the case. You're just saying, like, all you've done is proven to me that it can be. What can, multiple different can possibilities. be, like, it's ever to the same thing, like, Lee. <laughs> like, a D1 hasn't talked this entire time. But what I'm saying like, is my interpretation yeah, is valid he, based he off the evidence I gave. I first started speaking. And there's no like contradiction to my evidence, so I feel like it's a valid interpretation to give. Your evidence doesn't provide a; it's not a probability. None of your evidence asserts why it would be. How is it not a probability? It asserts why it evidence can. to support it. Okay, D balls. All you're saying is that yes, this can be the case. Like that's all you're telling me. You, yes, you're saying it's possible for this thing to refer to speed. Okay. Okay, why is then? it referring to speed? I, I don't care for you to tell me why it can. I'm explaining be. why it is referring to speed. What, yeah, what your I'm just saying also speak on that is is saying it can. What it I'm saying is it falls back. Okay, hold on. Repeat your evidence for why it is. I'm saying that strong can refer to general stats, and you agree to that. So, so, so a possibility. Why would it be a possibility? It's a flat out statement. It can be, and they don't have to be backed up by context. Yes, that's why I asked you why in this case is it. That's that's why I've been asking you for like what backs up that it is, not that it can be.
Oh, because it's a stronger guard. Right? Okay, I understand what you're saying now. Thank you. I would also just bring up it's a stronger guard. Right? Faster? You said, why would that why mean that guard is faster? Yeah, why is this guard, like, what does guard do to get faster? Why would not be an increase in his overall abilities mean he's strong? Well, what does he do? And like, like in I don't know what he stats. does to get faster. If, if I just like lift arm weights, that doesn't make me run faster. Well, his, actually, what does God do to get faster? Or his stronger? overall reaction speed then would be the case. From what? What does he do? From absorbing blood. Why? Do, that's that's only stated to increase his sand. Why does that increase the, decrease the rate his what body? What aspect moves? of his sand would you say it increases? Just the strength, like what the strength of his sand. And is it his even body. says in the data book scan that its strength becomes Gara. That is not what, please send that. I sent it, it's in scans one. The bloody tears of the dead blend with the mass of sand, even greater power called upon to provide carnage. And you know what that data scan is, right? What is it? That That's the jutsu file for Gara sand burial. That's referring to the sand. That's not referring to like any guard's actual speed. That's the jutsu file for his sand burial. Wait, are you ignoring the bottom part where it states funeral. where it states it's chrism blood absorbed by the sand, its strength becoming Gara's? I mean, yeah, it like it is a part of like Gar's repertoire. Yeah, sure. It can like still be a part of Gar, but it's not. No, I'm not saying it's like are you saying like it's increasing just the technique? That's what this whole file I'm not is. saying it's that's increasing it just the technique top, because like, that's not title. what it says. Or in like in the middle bolded part. It's not saying it increases just the technique. Mm -hmm. That's also what Gara says in the manga itself. Did you like here? I'll just get you the actual text, like he because it's referenced in the manga itself. He states it to be like he states. Hold on, because he references it in the manga itself. He says, "Um, bitter crimson tears flow from lifeless eyes and mingle with the endless stands, refer bestowing ever greater power upon the demon god." So you just like all this is just like it mixing with the sand. How does it mixing with the sand increase his strength at all, or increase his body says at all? It increases Gar's strength and lets us know that. Yeah, that's how, how? How? Like how would it? How would it be able to do that? I don't think that makes any sense. Increasing his overall sand capabilities, whatever goes with yeah, his, his overall, sand can, whatever he his uses, sand which can be, be better. Increased. Sure. How does his physical body be increased at all? If his sand can react, the sand to doesn't better, Is that not a body. stronger Gara? I'm not saying that he can't be physically. I'm not saying that he. Like, no, I'm not saying just physical like strength. I'm saying the sand itself would be better overall in hand. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah, that's not what I'm disagreeing with. I see why. Okay, I don't mind it. I don't mind like physical. Better. I don't mind physical. You said his reactions are better. I'm not disagreeing that the sand can be better. You said his reactions are better. I didn't say sand. Those are those are two different points, huh? I didn't specify on sand. No, you said his reactions. His reaction to Sans' reactions are not the same thing. The Sans actions. Oh, so. That's on me then. I didn't mean to say it like that. I meant to say like the sand itself gets an increase in overall abilities. Um, I don't, I don't know if that's the case, but for now, uh, I'll say like either way, like Gar is still shown to be able to keep up with Sasuke. Well, anyway, no, he literally so lacks the ability to keep up with Sasuke as the fight goes on. He, he literally turns his head, looks at Sasuke, puts a mental image in his head, and says he's just like he's just as fast as Lee was. Wait, isn't that prior to Sasuke amping up the speed? Wait, I'm about to show you another scan. No, that's flat as out. Sasuke no, hold on. Up his speed. He like flat out blitzes uh Gara later on after that statement. Y you're talking about when he jumps behind him and punches him in his face, right? No, nah, wait, I'm about to show you. Let me get this. I just saw like another instance of like Sasuke perceiving um I need this way, or Gara perceiving Sasuke. Sasuke. Okay, here we go. I'm not saying that he can physically this like move to keep faggot. up, but he can definitely like see and react like put like he does put up his arm to react to Sasuke. I just don't agree that he can like move his body to like move like No, I'm saying like he gets what off. I want to show you is like him getting fly like perception blitz. My Discord is just being fucking gay. Give me one second. Oh, all right, sure. If you have like perception blitz, then sure. Yeah. It's my phone always fucking lets me go to the scan it and just logs out. <laughs> okay. I think it's everything. Did you send the same one I'm sending? The fuck? I think it's gay. Yeah, he, he doesn't get perception listing that scan. We see him turn his head. No, because that's not even where Sasuke is. Sasuke's in front of him. He doesn't react to that. 
No, Sasuke is behind, like Sasuke runs behind him, right? Then Gara begins to attack at that part. You see that? Then Sasuke moves out of the way when like the sand's in front of Gara's. And then Sasuke blitzes him. Gara thinks Sasuke's behind yeah, him. The Gara's, Sasuke's in Gara's front of face him. where Sasuke was just at. But Sasuke's not there. Yeah, because he, yeah, he's okay. So when the sand, and what I'm gets saying in front is he's him, not reacting to him at so that he, point. Hold on, if the sand gets in front of him and he can't see where Sasuke's moving because he's trying to attack where Sasuke was just at, of course he can't see right there. Okay, so he so gets blitzed. He's not able to react, react to, react to Sasuke? Sasuke's movements. Huh? That just means the sand is literally in front of his eyes. What? You just noted that Gara looks behind, right? I'm saying Gara doesn't notice yeah, Sasuke. Yeah, Gara looks behind and sends the sand to that. attack Sasuke. And I'm saying that Sasuke, Gara doesn't notice Sasuke completely 360 his ass and kicking him in the face. He gets perception blitz. And because Gara and like physical blitz. is using the sand to attack where Sasuke was, and the sand is now in front of Gara's face because he is using it to push where Sasuke was just at. Okay, so Sasuke he has the inability the to reaction. The sand Sasuke isn't able to predict where Sasuke would be at. Okay, Gar doesn't have prediction ability. That's fine. I'm not saying he has prediction. But I'm saying okay. I didn't mean to say it like that. I'm just saying that like the sand can't. It can't react to Sasuke actually like per, like trying to blitz him. Oh, Gar isn't using his automatic defense here. He's fighting himself. Based off what? What? Okay, I'll just send it because he's like been like attacking Sasuke throughout like most of this debate or most of this fight. Can you show me? Y'all see like him saying that he's not using the sand's reaction. He's been attacking Sasuke. Okay, that like doesn't you, mean he's, he's not using, using the sand, sand to attack Sasuke. At all. Huh? That doesn't mean he's not using the sand reaction to like defend himself. I don't. I don't. Okay, get that. I'm saying that he's like, if he's physically controlling the sand, how is the sand going to be able to move on its own if Gar is controlling it? Are you saying the Can't sand do doesn't the go to protect Gar? If Gar is in the middle of controlling it, how is it supposed to be able to get out of Gar's control and jump after Sasuke? And can you show me that Gar is like manually making the choice to summon the sand there? Here, he, he literally, like, um, we literally see it, like, him, like, attacking Sasuke with a sand shield. Like, it, the sand shield, like, or, like, not a sand shield, with, um, with a sand clone. Right? Like, he gets into combat with Sasuke with a clone from the start of the fight as well. Because I could have sworn they note that the sand always protects Gara. It does. I'm not saying that. But this is, like, Gara okay, then, also yeah, isn't, like, usually... Gara isn't like usually per like he isn't usually fighting is what I'm saying. Like I'm not saying that like at other Wait, points. Wait, why does this mean he's, when Gara isn't mean, like, actually, actually controlling it, fighting with the clone? He just turned it to a sand uh -huh. clone. The yeah, sand the can sand still be acting on his own. The sand, okay, his automatic sand defense doesn't fight for him. No, I'm but saying he's turning the sand it. into a means of defending himself. This is all like you showed me here. Yeah, so like, that's what I'm saying. He's controlling. We see him controlling the sand. So you're saying this bottom part is him attacking? What happens after this? Um, this is when, like, Sasuke, like, runs at the sand clone, like, right after. Yeah, wait. That's my animation. <laughs> he, like, throws more to Naya. Wait, I'm here. Isn't it, like, what? Oh, no. Yeah, because we know, like, the sand clone doesn't, like, morph into, like, different figures and stuff. It's just meant to, like, be a, like, be a, basically, like, a body block for Gar. Okay, well, going off, like, the general statement that the sand protects, so I'm not gonna, like, I don't get why, like, this assumption that you're making works. To say like he's not okay because his sand, sand can't how, how, okay if he's physically like if he's physically binding it basically if he's binding the sand can you show right? me that he's because making he's, sure the sand can't protect him i'm not saying that okay if he's controlling it the sand can't move by itself if okay Gar's so basically you don't have like a, a flat out direction. statement you're like giving me an assumption Okay, like a flat out statement that guard that the sand can't move while guard making no, it move. Yeah, that and the fact that the sand's not trying to protect him okay, at all. You're saying like you're saying all if of Gar this is guard. Is... Hold on, if, if guard is taking control over its movement and the sand's perfect, you're not showing me that guard is taking control over his movements. He just turned it. To uh, a I sand just showed clone. you that Gar is controlling the sand. No, you just showed me that he's turning it into a clone. You're saying that, so that means it's he's controlling, controlling his it. overall movements in the fight. You're saying for the overall Hold fight. On. That's what you're telling me. D balls. If Gar is transforming the sand, what does that mean? I don't. He turned the sand into a clone. Why does that mean? That he's restricting means he's, control, it? he's in active control of the sand. No, that I don't believe that's what that means. I don't see anything so how providing is he evidence doing for that. Something if he what? So you agree that he's the one transforming it, but he doesn't have control over it. I'm not how saying is he transforming it. I'm not saying that Gar cannot like manually take control of the sand. That's not what I'm saying. You're saying that he's not letting the sand defend him. He's not letting that. That's not what I'm, I'm saying. That when he is controlling it. How can it defend him? Like, it shouldn't be able to defend him. But if controlling we know it goes movements. to protect him and you're not showing me any evidence for him controlling because, his okay, its ability, if Gar, oh my, it, you're giving me an assumption. I, I, don't, I don't know, like, how you're, how you're not understanding my point. If he's in the middle of move, 
like controlling where it goes, how can it go where it wants to if Gar is controlling where it goes at this moment? Where is there any proof that Gar is like manually controlling and limits its movement? Okay, the sand is meant for defense. Okay. Right? So in the scan that you sent, it is going out to attack Sasuke. Okay. So that means if the sand is only meant to defend Gara, but it's attacking, that means Gara must be the one making it attack. Where does it state that the, the sand, sand doesn't like, just attack? Wait, That's not what automatic Where does it state like does? that the it's... sand's only for defense? We see Gara kill people with it. With him using it. No, I'm just saying, right? Because you made a I'm claim saying that like the, the automatic sand. defense is for defense. That's, yes, that's what I'm saying. The, the actual sand defense. The thing okay, that well, you haven't itself. shown me a statement that him controlling it limits his ability. You're just giving me an assumption. And like, okay, I, don't have if, a, okay I, I just explained exactly. Like, I don't no, know like, I'm, how I'm, it makes sense. Like, I, I hear what you're saying, but I'm just saying it's nothing that proves that within this. And I'm your not, interpretation is not substantiated the by the show. Just the fact that it's controlling. Because that's not how the sand works. The sand doesn't work. Okay, can you attack. show me a statement of the sand not being able to work that way? Okay, you just you agree with me that the sand is meant for defense, but in this game, it's attacking. I never said that the sand was only for that. If I did, that's not what I exactly meant. Because the sand can you attack. Said that's what and you, you said didn't said specify. The you, you didn't said specify the, the passive defense. To protect Gara. So okay, you asked me like, are, the is the passive defense? I can't defense like go. I can't go with like you miswording yourself. Just send a statement of what the sand does. Send a statement of what the sand does. Yeah, yeah, what his automatic defense is. Wait, why wouldn't you send it? You're the one making a claim that the you're, sand you're the, can't you're the work one, if he's controlling could you, could it. Hold on, hold on. Could you agree with me earlier, and then you just said, if, if I did say that, that's not what I meant. So, so I can't just go with your misunderstanding. Like, you're misrewarding yourself anymore. Okay. You actually send what you meant. Okay, when is the um the Gar and Lee fight? Is that like... I think that's 80s. Um, the Gar and Lee fight is like in like the 80s, because I'm looking at what Conqueror says. He said okay. the difference from the sand shield where the grains automatically flow a, a form to... A, Flow to form a protective barrier. That's all it says. And you're saying, wait, wait, wait I'm gonna just look for it myself. I'm gonna ask you to repeat yourself. My fault. It just says that the sand flows to protect him, a protective barrier. That's that's all it says. Okay, so where does it, it say? It doesn't say like the sand automatically like fights. controlling him. Huh? So where does it say? I'm saying like that the automatic limited... sand, that the automatic sand is purpose to defend. That's what Conqueror states. That's what's stated about the sand. It's never stated. Well, he to says attack. the sand. He says the sand will like defend him in moments while he's being attacked. It like goes to protect his body. Yeah, but I'm saying if, if it's sent off in an entirely different direction, how is it supposed to do that? I, it's fiction. It could more than likely still work that way. That means it'd have to go across a greater di like it'd have to wait for Gar's command, then jump it's across called a greater more, distance it's to get to Sasuke. More sand, but okay, called more sand. Because he carries a whole ass sand net. Oh, oh, thanks. Who's that talking? Thanks, thanks but, for the extra. Yo. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm just showing you. like guards and like active control. Of but I'm the just sand saying. Room. I'm just saying that like it's nothing that you're showing that the sand can't also be independent while also working with. Mm -hmm. You're not showing me anything for that. So you're, like you're just making like an assumption. I, I've like explained more. I've given more than enough reason for why the sand shouldn't be able to like it shouldn't be expected to take like this larger feet. But you're not also no, just, you're just saying, and then also just consistent the sand, for the sand has like this um, premise well. of defense, right? So and therefore, then it's also just consistent for the sand to be able to perceive Sasuke as well. But the sand, no, the sand loses that ability, and Sasuke is or, right or for Gar to be able to fight goes Okay, on. but Gar is still able to perceive Sasuke. Gar gets perception blitz by Sasuke. I, I just showed him perceiving Sasuke like three, and times. I showed you a I, scan I showed, of him not being able to perceive Sasuke. So that's one out of the three. One out of three where? What did you send three scans of him perceiving oh, Sasuke? No, no. Uh, okay. I, I sent the one where he literally watches. Are Sasuke you showing me the beginning of the fight? That's fine. I said Sasuke's. No, that's that scan, that scan like that scan is after the one that you hold on, it's like after or right before the one that you sent. You're talking about the one that you one just Sasuke recently against sent. No, yeah, that scan is clear. after the one that you sent. The one where he kicks him in his chin, that's after the one see. that you sent. That's the one where Sasuke's running around guard. That's after the last one. I don't recall that. Let me look real quick. The second page that you sent is the page right before the one that I sent. That, that is at the end of the fight. I'll send you like the exact order that they're in. Let me look. And this is when yeah, guys, and this is sure. when Sasuke stated to be at weightless lead speed. It's when he does this speed here. Let me see. Here you go. No, the I scan where the, the scan where wait. Yeah, they're not the same. The scan that I sent is right is after the one that you sent. Wait. Okay, let me just make sure what scan you're saying you sent. So which scan? The one of him looking at the Sasuke. One where he's like, where, the image? one where Gar like shows like two different reaction marks to Sasuke like coming to kick him in his face. 
No, are you saying the one where he sees like the leave behind Sasuke? Did. No, that's not the one that I sent. Okay, that's not the one you're talking about. Because you're saying that well, no, I'll send that one as well, but that's not the one I sent. That's not the one I sent just now. But okay, so which one are you referring one, to like, right now? Uh, the one where like Gar like shows to be able to perceive Sasuke. Like he like shows like reaction marks next to Gar's face, and he actually all, also puts his arm up. He just can't. So you're like, saying the ones like, you just sent is the one you're referring to? So we're clear. Yes, yes, that's the one we're going over right now. Okay. Yeah, and I showed one before that, so he still is able to get perception blitz. That's fine. And I already said this would be like a greater Gara. From like his sand being enhanced. Like, can you hear me? Bro, you hear me? All right, there we go. But um, no, okay. you never proved like why Gara himself would have like higher perception of reactions. Well, he was able to react to Lee also. He also like visibly looks okay, at Lee. So, so this doesn't prove that I okay, so this doesn't prove that Sasuke's faster if you can perceive both. Wait, so if you could perceive okay, so you're agreeing that he was able to perceive gated Lee because he looks and my at whole Lee. point was that they're relative. He could perceive both. Okay, so you're saying Sasuke and Lee, even while in gates, are relative to one another. No, I didn't say... When does he perceive gated Lee? Okay, let me show you. Okay, that's why I asked you, because I didn't want you to agree to some shit that you ain't mean. Are you talking about the gourd? Mm -mm. Like, he literally, like, looks at Lee, like, flat out. Let me send this. Okay. Make sure I'm setting everything out. We're okay. It's like more of him like showing exclamation points when he's like looking at uh Gated Lee. This is like somebody moving in the air. I don't care about this. Huh? It's literally like stated, should nobody move slower in here. By Eno? Yes. Who is Eno? Is Eno a ta is Eno like a, a specialist in movement of ninjas? Why, why, why does she have to be to know how the human body works? <laughs> this ain't the normal human body. This is dark. This is fiction. Th this is just an enhanced version of this. What? And what I'm saying is, unless you provide Eno about, like this when I specialist. Say normal human body, I'm not saying she's referring to our human body. Like, <laughs> are you and what I'm saying is, she doesn't have knowledge on human she doesn't have complete her knowledge on like ninjas' ability to like re like move it. She just move should be air. able to know how a human body works. Okay, so she's just making an assumption unless you provide that she's like credible with her information. Okay, it's like if I say if I stab you, you're gonna bleed. You're gonna okay, say, and you have, you and guess how we know that? Because we've seen niggas get stabbed and bleed. <laughs> Who the fuck has Eno been watching? She's that she been has this fight, so she see people move slower in the air. <laughs> what? How many? Show me another instance prior to that where Eno's like, oh yeah, I've seen this dude move in air. He's slower. Why, why do I need to? What? Because you're saying that Eno's a credible source that I should take into account. D for your how, how do you know I've seen someone get stabbed? So you haven't seen someone get stabbed? Then you're no longer how reliable. Do you, know you don't know. Oh. I no longer can but trust you. How do you know you I haven't seen someone get stabbed? If you're not telling me, then why would I believe you? I don't have to show you. What? You can't deny it. Huh? So if you don't, if you're not showing me what you're saying is correct with any type of way of validating your credentials with that information, then I should still listen to you. I'm saying that, like, okay, I'm saying if we have no way to draw out her credibility, right, we would just assume her statement is false. If there's nothing to back up her credibility, I have no reason to take it as a fact. Okay. Like, <laughs> do you think, like, character the Naruto didn't be lying? Like, I don't understand. Like, the, the I don't know why I should right? trust Eno. Right, this is also, hold on. This is all, I, I think they'd just be backed up by the fact that Kakashi is using this as his battle plan. Kakashi also would also think the same thing. Kakashi he's just states this? what Kakashi's battle plan is. Wait, hold on. He's Kakashi heat states on. that fighting in the no, air makes me slower. No, he's forcing Hidon to jump up so that so that Shikamaru can get him with shadow possession. Because it'd be harder for Hidon to move out of the way. Enon, Eno's just commenting on what Kakashi's doing. Can you show that's me that? That's all she's doing. Okay. <laughs> that's why she make. That's when the statement's made. She's watching Hidon and or Kakashi. I don't know. I'm going off your. <laughs> I'm going off your evidence. Yeah, it's it's uh.
Also, I would argue with Lee that that wouldn't be the same case because they literally know that he's faster in the air. So, like, it wouldn't even matter. Where's the state, though? Well, I'm not saying... State, let me correct that. Let me correct that. Let me correct that because that sounds really bad. What I'm saying is his speed in the air is still noted to be, in like, fast. He's not noted to be slower in any way. That's what I meant to say. Just to clarify that. That sounded yeah, bad can, at first. He can still be fast. Wait, where, where okay, is what that? What I'm saying is... Actually? Yeah. What I'm saying is, like, Gated Lee is still, like, even with his speed Actually, and yeah, right... Show me where that state is. That he's still, like, like he's fast in the... Like, he's fast? I don't remember, like, saying that he's fast in the air. Like, he's okay. fast specifically in the air. No, I, I remember correct saying myself. That when, he's like, say- when he has, like, Gar, like, caught on by a string, when he's, like, pulling himself towards Gar. Doesn't he catch him with the string later, like, at the end of the combo? Or am I tripping? Uh, no. That's the only way that he has... I think that's, like, the only way that he has Gar in midair right now. Oh no, he's, like he's beating. No, he just kicked the dog shit out of him. He wraps him up at the end of it. It's chapter mm. eighty-seven where he wraps him up. No, yeah. I don't think that. I don't think that's the case. No, I can. I can show it. I can show you. Yeah, show me when he like captured or when he like tagged. Or, and I will give you the chapter too. This chapter eighty-seven. And then he literally like does it at the end of the combo. So like that's fine. Let me like show it being noted that he, like he's still fast. Crop your scans. <laughs> Never mind. This is a Kakashi's plan. This is Shikamaru's. Yeah, she's just like watching what like what Shikamaru's like. She's just watching like Shikamaru's interaction with Hidon and just commenting on what's happening. She's not just like she's not just making like some random separate claim about nothing. She just talks. Okay, let me see. Okay, yeah, like I said, that wouldn't like apply to Lee because Lee's in state to be slower in the air. What did you say? Not, I said I wouldn't apply to Lee because Lee's in state to be slower in the air. Would you, uh, like I've asked you for a reason. Like, I was waiting for you to send like why. Oh no, I fast. sent it. Where like he's noted to still be fast. Like nothing states. That's where they literally the don't know where Lee's at, and that's not Lee's not in the air at that moment. That's he's when he in the, no, he's in the air when he's dog fucking Gar before he wraps. Not, him not up. in the scan that you just sent when they say he's fast. That's when he kicks Gar into the air. They're that's when he kicks Gar in the air and then it proceeds onward. Why no, they, like, but he isn't in the air when they make that. He's statement. even. He's so still. He's still getting remarks on his speed after the fact. But that's not when he's in. The, okay, show me the statement of him when he's in the air. You just sent me a statement for when he kicks Gar on the floor. That doesn't prove your point. I feel like it does, but okay. What the on, him running around proves that he's him being him still getting compliments on his speed. Yeah, even when he's in the, the air, floor. showing that it's not limiting. It the way. I'm gonna show the statement I'm talking about. Than base. This is still Lee on the floor. You're trying to prove that Lee is still fast in the air. I'm not. To I'm saying there's nothing. It's nothing remarked about him being slower, like Hadan was remarked by. Okay. Um, yeah, know. they don't have to remark. Yeah, they don't state all. They the do time have to state it because not every it. ninja works the same. Not every ninja's what? the same. Why do their bodies work differently? What? Well, obviously the techniques they would use will affect their bodies differently. So they. Yeah, I'm asking you to show situation. that this technique makes him faster in the air. I never. What I'm saying is that his speed isn't decreased in the air. Okay, and for what reason is that? Because it's not stated he's slower, therefore he's not. Yeah, if it's nothing to say, I just say, gave a reason. I just gave something that states that you're slower in mid. And I'm saying is that wouldn't apply to Lee. Why does that apply to Lee? Okay, why? What's the difference? What's the because difference if no one's saying Lee? damn Lee's slower in the air, it's she. Yeah, why did okay? The that, okay, that's then why would we connect the two? It's two different characters, two well, different that's scenarios they're in. Okay, but I'm saying that what makes these two different? What makes these situations different? Because obviously Lee Gates gives some just better maneuver, like he can work in the air to be slower. What's happening here? What I'm saying is that Lee's like ability that allowed him to get to this point where he's fucking knocking Gar in the air and booty fucking him and shit isn't limiting his speed in any way. Otherwise, yeah, he he's just went faster. To the air. Yeah, yeah. Lee is faster. I'm not disagreeing. Why does this ability? Why do? Why do the gates? Why would Lee? No. Why air? would Lee go into the air? Right? If it would make him slower. That would. That's what the reverse lotus is. That's what all the lotuses are. They're attack. They're barrages in the air. Okay. So what I'm saying is Lee is not a dime. Like your opponent can't fight back. No, that's fine. That's fine. If Lee feels comfortable to fight in the air and Hadan, noted by Eno and Shikamaru's fucking plan, isn't someone that can work in those situations, he would be slower. They're not the same. They're not, you can't correlate Wait, But the she's scenarios. not commenting specifically on heat. Like, she's not saying, like, Hedon's just the type of person that works slower in the, That's not what she says. Well, I'm going off the fact that I only seen that comment in regards to Hadan. 
Yeah, she just states it's harder to move in the air, but he got him. If anything, I think she's referring to Shikamaru. Why would that? Why would they even? Shikamaru's even a nigga who fights in the air. That's the one that she. That's the one fighting right now. If it's referring to Shikamaru, he's a grounded fighter. That's fine. Lee can what? obviously, like you just said, Lee, like Lee's a uh, fucking. Why does boom. that change how you move your body? Like, I, I, like no, you're, you're saying that, that Lee being, being you're saying like being different. in the air, right, is making you slower. I, I don't, like it's not making you like, again. Like it's just like harder to maneuver, right? There's more force. Okay, so it's not like, limiting speed. You're not more. slower. Like, I, I, huh? So they're not slower. I don't think you'd be moving at the same speed. I, I don't agree that you'd be moving at the same speed. So are you they saying they're to, slower like, they or not? They don't state the words that you are slower. They just state that like it's harder to maneuver. Okay, so I'm asking you, what are you saying? Is it are they slow? that is harder for Lee to move maneuver in midair, which allows for guard to react. It's obviously not a problem for Lee. The only reason why Gar was able to react why? is later on, right, where he like used the gore is because Lee was like fucking weak. Why, why are you saying that's not a problem for Lee? Because because he's in the air. The why would like punching? Why would like slower? punching someone you casually are doing this anyway? Why would that like? Why would he be limit? What shows limit like him being limited anyway in that scenario? You said you you just gave me like no explanation that correlates to the, like to the point right now. No, what I'm saying is that nothing shows Lee being limited in his movement. You even said the technique okay. he's using yeah, okay. is something Debo, he you're uses in the okay. air. You're, you're just denying it just because they don't think that. No, what I'm saying is you literally agreed that the move Lee is using, right, to fight Gar at this moment is something he he's using in the air. It works for the air. So why would he be limited? That don't make like it. I don't make sense if it's because if it works this in this condition. He uses in mid air, therefore there can't be any limits to it in mid air. Like, that doesn't make it. That for make Lee, no you're sense. showing me Hadan. How does Hadan say Okay, and I'm telling you, okay, okay, you keep Shikamaru referencing work that, for Lee. And I ask you, what is the difference between these two? Like these two people at this point. I already stated the technique Lee allows, allows me to allow fight in the air. You already agreed that the technique is something that you use for the air. Then you using the gates. So I said, why do the gates allow him to maneuver better in mid air? And then we went into the technique. You said the technique that Lee uses. Is something he uses for in the air, correct? Okay, why does that allow him to move better in the so air? So he wouldn't be. Why would he use a move where he's fucked? Why would you make yourself worse? No, I don't think he has to be like. I don't think he has to be like. Like I don't know, massively slower. Okay, if you still, can't like, quantify it, it a, then he's not slower. Hold on, hold on. He's still at a point where Gar is unable to defend himself. Right? What is you sand? They say no. The they say his like, sand attack, can't defend himself. Hold on, hold on, because it's still an advantage for Lee. Right, because Lee at this point doesn't need a speed advantage. He already has a speed advantage over Gar. Right, he just needs he just needs high strength. And he needs to like break Gar like with. Well, no, they literally state Gar that he's using the speed right? to beat his. So he sand. Take, hold on, he takes Gar's main defense away from him, which is the automatic sand defense. He takes his main defense away from him, and he takes Gar's ability to move away from him as well while he's in the air. Hold on, they literally state. So Mario literally states the sand can't keep up. Much of the sand's been torn away. This is not good. Then uh, my guy states the reverse lotus is a series of tight jutsus performed with such speed that the attacker is untouchable. This rapid movement yeah, I agree. Is, are, like, I, is I, Lee's I'm not, I'm key not to winning Lee's the match. So they're not like they're not even speaking of the AP. They're referring to the speed. No, but that's why Lee uses the gates. That's what Lee says himself. He says if long as Gar has that armor, his speed is irrelevant. Lee if says he has before he goes in the first gate, wasn't he already blitzing Gar's speed prior to that? That's that's my point, D balls. His speed doesn't matter. He doesn't have the AP to do anything. And when I, okay, that's so there's nothing that shows Lee is getting limited in maneuverability like a Don. They don't correlate. Okay, that's all I'm and saying. I gave okay, D balls, and I've given a statement, and your rebuttal is they don't state it here because they're two different characters, and you already agreed okay, the technique allows Lee to work better in the air. Between so wait, these two characters that allows one to be like that allows like one mobility to be slower in the mid air, and Lee's isn't. Like what, Wait, hold what, on. What's so you already agree Lee's technique, right? What, what is happening? Wait, so you already agree Lee's technique allowed him to work better in the air like Hadan. No, right? I never agreed to that. I agree that he uses it in the air. I never agreed that it works better. Why would he use something in the air that's ineffective? Uh, it, it isn't ineffective. It's still effective. Like, just because it isn't his best move doesn't mean that it's his worst. If it made him slower, it'd be no point. He could just do it on the ground. Because he, he still, still has higher guard. AP, and he's restricting guard from all of his defenses while he's in the air. They don't air. even say like it's a necessity for him to be in the air. That's what the reverse lotus is. The reverse lotus primarily has to work within the air. That, that's what the reverse lotus is. Like, like there is no other like version of the reverse lotus. They're, like the lo this is the reverse lotus. Okay, cool. My fucking memory's trash. But yeah, still, my point stands. Hadan wouldn't correlate to Lee. You know, statement wouldn't correlate. Why? I'm asking you what the because difference Lee between Lee has techniques like, that allow him to work within the air. air. I'm going off less assumptions than you are. You're making an assumption. I'm. I'm. <laughs> what? 
Because you're what, telling what, me that, like, Lee's using doing? it. Okay. Lee's, like, Devo, maneuverability is limited. You're the one assuming, me, right, that there's something, like, different in their body. For I literally named the difference in how Lee is as a person, his character, from a dime. His, his I'm not just saying, like, matter. a random thing. When I say in character, I mean, like, his actual techniques and such. That's what I'm referring to. What is, what is, okay, and I'm asking you, what is he using that makes him still move at the same speed midair? That's Why would he use the reverse lotus that makes him slower in the air? Because I just gave you multiple reasons. His speed because if ninjas, the, if ninjas' maneuverability is, is limited within the air, and Lee okay, is Zemo, limited Zemo, his Zemo, movement, Zemo, Zemo. it would be an ineffective technique. It doesn't matter technique. if he loses speed because his speed isn't the issue here. His speed does not, not matter here. His that's speed definitely matters because they even know no, the reason he's himself. using the reverse lotus is to outspeed the sand. as long as Gar is able to defend against me. And what I'm saying is my guy flat up states, or he gives the implication, right? He substantiates the claim I'm making that Lee is increasing his speed to outbeat the sand. He just says it's a high speed combo. What? No, he states. He states. These rapid moves are Lee's key to winning the match. The speed of the moves, right? The speed, not the AP. They don't know the AP. I, I'm not agreeing that they that he still can't be faster than Gar. Huh? I'm How does that relate to what I just said? He can still be faster than Gar. His, his punches could be this level of speed. You showed me like him like dashing down or like him pulling himself down to Gar. You showed Gar reacting to that. Wait, did I not show you him like fucking pinballing him through the air with no wraps? That, that, that's not Gar doesn't react to that. Did I not send that way? And that's fine. You didn't think Gar reacting to that, no? Right. And he's re and, no, and the times I show him reacting is before he gets wrapped up, he's getting smacked like a pinball. No, you showed you the scans that you sent are when Lee's moving down to Gara, not when he's actually hitting him. No, they're showing Gara's perspective from like Lee's fucking assault of attacks that he's doing there, onto like none Gara. of those hold on, none of those scans show Gar reacting to a punch. Gar literally, Gar doesn't. I'm saying he reacts. Period. He didn't react to Sasuke's punch. He reacts to his movement. And swimming through the like him flying through the air. Wait, hold on. You say re we're talking about movement. Sasuke didn't even attack. That him. is not what we were talking about. I showed Gar reacting to like Sasuke's attacks. He didn't react to his attacks. He reacted to the Gar movement, Sasuke not running. the attacks. These aren't his attacks. These are Lee moving, like his movement through the air. These are two different things. We're, and you showed me Sasuke's movement. You didn't show me him. No, I showed you him not reacting being to Sasuke able, him being reacted by Gara. No, look at the scan I sent you. I sent you him reacting to Sasuke, kicking him in his face. I did not send you. He him doesn't react to that. Wait, hold on. <laughs> what you sent me, the sand, the sand, right, is about to take the kick. Sasuke then loops around, punches Gar. He doesn't react to the kick. I mean, not punch. He doesn't react to the kick. Yes, he does. You see two, you see two reaction marks right next to his face indicating that he's no. No, he reacts reaction. to the movement of Sasuke. He gets kicked. That's not him reacting to the kick. No, okay. Why is he? Why did the reaction marks pop up when Sasuke's getting ready to kick him? No, he reacts. He has the exclamation points when Sasuke's rolling over to him. That which no, is fine. you see his foot going up in the air. No, that's before the foot. You goes also up see in him air. put his arm up because that's before the foot goes in the air. So that's not his, like he's not like attacking him yet. Yeah, I'm saying he's reacting to like Sasuke, like getting ready to hit him. He's reacting. To Sasuke okay, and then Gar is reacting to Rock Lee getting ready to hit him. Yeah, there's a difference between okay, there's a difference between Sasuke actually like moving himself like to kick Gara, and it's like Gar or Lee just moving through the air. Can you give a there quantifiable amount of how much slower Lee would be in the what? air? I'm saying, all, I'm saying all I'm scaling is combat speed. And you're scaling like Lee. No, but like why would him? Okay, so it doesn't matter then. If you can't give me like a quantification, then what uh, amount okay. of slower is Lee that it matters? Not, what? Okay, you're so you're saying Lee's maneuverability in the, the air. You're the one scale guards reaction to a 50 at Lee's movements. And say, therefore, he reacts to his combat speed. You would have to be the one to prove that they're the same speed. He's looking. He's literally looking right before he's able to get punched. He's doing the same okay, thing so he, he gets yeah, his wait, hold reaction on. is the same the thing he is, does. Hold on. His reaction is before Lee is launching an attack. So you can't say that he's reacting to an attack. He literally the same thing in your skin. He's reacting before Sasuke attacks him. No, he's reacting when Sasuke is going to attack. Like he's literally kicking him. He's get like trying He to does not right react there. to the kick. He only sees Sasuke moving towards we him. We literally see the him put his arm up as well. Yes, he does react to the kick. He shows another reaction mark showing that he's reacted to the kick as well. No, he's just he showing reaction to Sasuke moving you know, towards him, not the he kick. I don't agree Sasuke with that. Moving there. Hold on. He reacts to Sasuke moving there and he reacts to the kick because he shows another set of reaction marks and put his arm up. I disagree. So only thing you can show me is him reacting to the movement. Not the kick. Hold on, hold on. Look, in one scan he's reacted to the movement, and in the other scan we show another set of reaction marks. So you're saying in the one where he rolls like, over to Sasuke, right? You're looking marks. at when he rolls over. Yeah, hold on, and then look at the scan next to that. Why is he seeing another set of reaction marks? What's that for? 
Okay, so you're saying he's just showing reaction to the movement. He hasn't got kicked yet. He reacted to the same movement twice. No, why do they not show the exclamation point when he's getting kicked? They do. He's reacting to the kick also. He he shows reaction Sasuke moving towards him. They keep that same exclamation point because he's looking at the movement. But they know it in a another scan. They know two explanation marks. They show like they show the explanation mark twice. What are you talking about? Okay, either I'm looking at the wrong yeah, scan. I'll I'm looking right it. below. Yeah, I'll just resend it. Go, go to the bottom. Yeah. I'll resend it. Look on the right scan. Right, we see two explanation marks to Sasuke's movement. Right. Okay. Then you go to the left panel. Right, because it's left to right, or it, it's, I'm sorry, it's right to left. Right. He okay. reacts to Sasuke moving towards him. This is when he's rolling or whatever, right? right. Then we see him show two explanation marks once again. Because he's seeing so Sasuke's movement. He's not reacting to the kick. If he's already reacted to the movement, why would they show another set of explanation marks? They're just showing in the sequence of him noticing it. So why would he no How does he notice the same thing twice? Why would they not why show the explanation point when he's getting kicked? It don't make sense. That, that would show that he's re noticing that Sasuke is getting ready to kick him. And he's and Gar's noticing that so, that uh, Lee's getting ready to um, punch him in the fucking face. No, he's noticing that Lee is moving in to punch him. They never show that he reacts to the punch. He's not reacting to the kick here. That's not what you're showing. Yes, that's what it shows. Movement. That's what the explanation marks in the second page are for. The only time, if you're saying right from left, the only time the exclamation points are there is when Sasuke is moving towards him. When the no, look in the first no, no, that's the first one, and then in the second one, when Gar is literally putting his hands up for some odd reason, he put his arms up right. And they show another set of reaction marks. So if he's already reacted to one movement, right, what, what reason would they have to show that same reaction again unless he's reacted to the next movement, which is Sasuke's kick? That's I don't why see there's it. another set of reaction marks here. That interpretation just doesn't make sense. Movement. Just because, like, the it could literally just mean what I'm saying. And he's just seeing the movement. Okay, yeah, and show, he's me like, when they show, he's like, show me when they give reaction marks for the same exact movement twice. Why do I have to show you that? the same person. Why do I have to show you that? What? Why do I have to show you that? This would be specific That's to this scenario. Like you're saying that Gar's, you said they're showing reactions for the same movement. So I have to show you another character doing it? Yeah, because that makes no sense. Why is he reacting you to the same movement? No, I wouldn't. Why do I have to show it? If I'm talking about Gar specifically in this moment, yeah, like, no, no manga sure. artist even, like, consistently Gar does the same, the same shit for every panel. Yeah, go ahead. Show me Gar reacting to the same movement twice. It doesn't matter who you show. Just show I don't need to show you that. I'm looking, we're talking about this twice. scene. I don't have to show you that. I said, go ahead and get a Gara thing then. What I'm saying is, I don't have to show you. I don't have to show you anything to like prove that in other situations that's the same case. Because I'm showing you here. Okay, and I'm saying that there's literally no, like what backs that up because it's more consistent. Because we see him only showing the exclamation on. points Rebo, during the movement. It's more consistent for them to just be reacting to a movement, right? So if he's already reacted to one of these movements, why is he react to the same thing twice? They're just showing the sequence of events. Yeah, from him doing the role to get to him, his movement, and then... Or just hit. Gara seeing the role and trying to, like, in some way do something. Yeah, he's already seen the role, and he shows his reaction to the role. He's already seen the role. He gives his reaction to the role. He notices that. Right? And then he gets fucking blitzed. He wasn't able to react so fast enough. So what's his reason for reacting a second time? He wasn't able to react fast enough to the kick anyway. Uh, that's not my point. I'm saying that he can perceive one. And he, I'm showing that same thing for Gar perceiving Gated Lee. No, you're saying that he perceives. Okay, there, again, we've gone over. There's a difference between movement and combat. You haven't showed him reacting to an attack from. Why movement. would me not coming to punch you be my combat speed? Because he isn't actually punching. It's like if I'm running at you, holding a punch. I'm not. That's not the same as me swinging it. <laughs> if I'm a combat speed, would be my speed within combat. Lee is in combat. No, I, okay. Well, then movement. obviously, like you're not like, not understanding my definition. I mean, like the actual speed of your attacks. That's what I'm referencing when I say combat speed. The speed of your attacks, not the movement. The speed of what you just like you're just moving your. Okay, body. then he doesn't perceive the kick. I still don't see that from what you showed me. Okay, I, I just okay. Well, I don't know. I think I've like given way more than enough for why that second explanation mark would be him perceiving the different movements. That's what the explanation marks are for, right? Him perceive, him noticing movements. That's what explanation marks for. So if he's already noticed this movement, like him rolling towards him, they'd have no reason to note him noticing it, the same exact thing again. And okay, if you, feel like, if you feel like you back this up, you can like go here, to the next point Sasuke then. trying to kick him. Yeah, if you don't agree with me, fine. Like whoever's been listening can just like judge the point himself. But that would just be him noticing the kick, right? Because he's already noticed Sasuke rolling towards him. He have no reason to notice the same thing again if he already knows it's happening. It's making sense. So mm -hmm. he, noti he noticed the Sasuke kick and reacts to it. You haven't shown him like perceiving an attack for Lee. Okay, I feel like I, I feel like I defended my point. So we can like go to the next point.
Okay, sure. Well, then there's like, of course, the guy statement and the lead statement I've already gone over. I say that Sasuke should be like on weightless Lee's level. Weightless Lee, uh, like, should be referring to base here because I think I've like solidified that enough. You don't think Gates like, is a base... part of weightless Lee like repertoire that he would use? Huh? You don't. You don't think weightless Lee would encompass Gated Lee also? Yeah, but I, I explained like what form of weightless they're referring to using the Lee statement. Like, and I, okay, we've already gone over this. I'm basically okay, just already concluding our points. Okay, thank you. I just <laughs> okay. So what would be the next point then? Like AP. Um, I'm not. I'm not giving AP scaling because then you just during the gates anyway. Okay. Oh yeah. I, pff, what the fuck? I think I was talking about Lee. I've been fucking uh, on him so Steve. much. <laughs> We've been talking about Lee so much. I fucking thought that's what I was talking about. Okay. So we talked about speed. I would say like Sasuke skills over Neji due to the fact I'm like scaling above the QB and Naruto that uh, Neji fought. And like, let me send the scans. For when does Chunin is him Sasuke scale above a QB and Naruto? Huh? I'm talking about like the one that Neji fought. Wait, I'm about to show it. I keep fucking. Yeah, how does Sasuke sail above that QB? Wait, I'm about to show you. Basically, like uh, Naruto shows inferiority to the semi transformed Gara that Sasuke was just fighting. Let me find it. Give me one second. They need to let you make like fucking mini folders within this shit. Okay. Where the fuck is this? If I fails, I just look back. Okay, here we go. Okay, I sent it. And Arthur, like, flat out states, he's like, I don't know if I can handle this guy. And this is before he gets into actual interaction with Gar. He hasn't seen anything from this Gar. He has seen that. He literally seen the dude Sasuke get his ass would buy him. He has like some measure to note of Gar's capabilities. He did Even not see that fight between him and Sasuke. He comes in at the end of the fight. What are you talking? So you don't about? think Naruto's making a judgment just from his general understanding of Gar? What is his gen like? What and understanding wait, does he have? Base, all he knows wait. that Sasuke. Uh, all he knows is that Gar has like extreme. Are blockers. you saying base? Are you saying base? Uh, Naruto is equal to semi transform Gar. Um, he's shown to like react to him when he's doing a thousand years of death, and he reacts to multiple of Gara's jutsu. That Gara is not trying. He literally states he's not like being serious with Naruto. Let me show that. Yeah, sure. Like, at, like when he's doing a thousand. I'm gonna show years it after he gets stabbed in the butt, which confirms that only happened because Gara's fucking around with him. And I'm gonna show before he yeah, gets stabbed sure. in the butt. Yeah, sure. Yeah, I got you. Which chapter is it? Of the fight, I think it's like two thirty something. Make sure I'm getting these in the right order. Is this when he says it? Okay, here we go. Naruto Gara is 132, I think. Thank you. So yeah, here's like, after he gets stabbed in the butt, he notes, I underestimated him. I'm ending this now. And then before he gets stabbed in the butt, he also, he states like, I'm going to play around with you, see how long you last until you fucking give up. So Naruto's like clearly in That's when he's, okay, that, when he says I'm ending this now, that's when he's about to like, that's when he's about to fully transform. That's when he's going into his one tail state. He transformed later on. And even then, that's no, fine. Right but I'm after this, all no, I'm so right, the sequence of events is right after this. Wait, hold on. Just so I don't lose right, my point, right? What I'm trying to Nar say. He gets hit by the Uzumaki barrage. What I'm saying is that Gara in this fight, prior to the scan I just sent, was not taking Naruto of a threat. He was he was not trying. So he, he doesn't like take, he doesn't think like Naruto's as skilled as what Naruto shows. Why does that mean he's holding back his stats at all? Huh? He literally says, I'm gonna play with you and before like killing you. He's not being serious. How do you when a cat plays with a mouse? Is he going all out to fuck the mouse up? Hold on, hold on. Yeah, let me go to, like that statement that you're referring to, like the one where he says he's playing with him. For the first, yeah, I'm it's the play second one. Without letting you it's die. the second I'm scan. That how I'm long saying. it takes for you to uh, give up on your friends and try to run away, but you want to escape? Yeah. Oh, okay. He can like this is when like Gar is like not actually like physically interacting with uh, act, rent, interacting with Naruto. He's just sending jutsu at him. No, but he has an understanding of Naruto's abilities. So why, like, are you saying he's not making a baseless claim? He doesn't find Naruto impressive, so he's fucking around with him. He doesn't find him like he still. He was more invested in fighting Sasuke over Naruto. Uh, I'm not disagreeing with that. He, yeah, he like knows so, of, like Sasuke. He lo he like knows of Sasuke's like ability, specifically Chidori. Right? Or he just, like he finds it. Sasuke a worthy opponent just generally. And with this, we have showings that he does not. He doesn't make about... a statement of like what why he views Sasuke as a strong opponent. All we know is that he's seen Chidori. Which would if Chidori, if Chidori wasn't Sasuke something that he couldn't like, if he could blitz, right, That's then why would he find it impressive? I'm, I'm not saying that he can blitz Sasuke. Like, no, Sasuke I'm just, can still I'm have just saying he can't be just the Chidori. Gets, like, Sasuke can't have high speeds 
But the reason that Sasuke is like the strongest opponent, or why he views him as like the high, this highest level of standard, right? Who that should, like just hard counters him because that's all we know that he has seen from Sasuke. That's and what I'm saying is, we we'll also have to include his stats. Training. That's what I'm saying. It just wouldn't be the Chidori. Why? Because if he can't, re if Sasuke can't react or blitz him in any way, right? Okay, I'm would, saying that Sasuke, no, but I'm saying what would the Chidori be? For? He doesn't How have that to matter? throw that out the window if he already knows that Sasuke had like he can see Sasuke's level of speed with Chidori because like, we don't know if Guard knows that, that the Chidori is an amp. All we know is they see Sasuke running around with Chidori in his hand. He's like, wow, that's that's pretty strong, and fast, dude. Because with Chidori, Sasuke is strong enough to just blitz Guard, and he's also able to react to him normally. Okay, but I'm saying that Gara at the point that he's like going insane, calling Sasuke this strong opponent, all this, these things happen before, these things are like, a lot of these things are stated before the fight even starts. He says, Sasuke, he no, he finds Sasuke, Sasuke impressive as his, they're fighting, like training. he even notes it. What? But wait, I don't want to lose the, I don't want to like go off topic, I feel like we're jumping here. So like, on, like the Naruto um versus Gara thing and Gara like being suppressed. Before we go yeah, on to this. Yeah, he could just be like holding back his, like uh, again, like why is this referring to his, like his speed? If I'm underestimating why somebody, to wait, hold on. To hit him? If I'm underestimating someone, right, and I'm fucking around with them, why would that entail that I'm hold? Like, why would not be a general me holding back everything? No, don't ask me why wouldn't it prove why it would. I'm showing why it would, because Gar is only no. Hit your statement just fell back on you shifting the burden of proof. You just gave me. You just explained again what he's doing, and I said, why wouldn't this be the case? So you're All asking you me why? So wait, what, what are you Naruto, asking? Why me? So I'm clear. This mean overall stats? Wait, so what are you what asking me? So I'm why curious. does this include over, like, why does he have to allow himself to be hit by Naruto? If he could just fool Naruto or blitz him. Wait, if he's under, he hold on. So like if he's he playing have... around with Naruto and not expecting him to do anything impressive, and then Naruto surprises him with, like, a tactic. Yeah, and he's why not... does he have to, but he never allows Naruto to get close to him. Huh? He gets stabbed in the butt. Yeah, and that's that's the scene that we're talking about. Don't use that as your evidence. No, but he gets yeah. stabbed in the butt because he's not taking him seriously. Because late, literally, no, right I don't after think that, he's allowing Naruto to get there because he's shown to try to stop Naruto on his way down there. But that doesn't mean he he's using max power. That's what I'm Naruto saying. Face, this Gara is not a hundred percent. This is not like okay, it doesn't I'm scale asking, him. Why is he allowing Naruto to hit him with attacks? He didn't he fight. Said, yeah, Naruto outplayed hit. him. Naruto outplayed him. It was just like it was like outsmarting the opponent rather than just like Naruto being greater. Okay, even then, saying, why is Gara making his speed any less? Why can't it just be his AP? Because if I'm like, playing around with you, why am I going serious? That's what I'm asking you. Like, why yeah, would I why be going can he serious? be holding? Why can't he be like holding his punches? Can you show me that? Can you show me he's I, holding I'm back his punch your, and not his that speed? Your case, Default, we just have two interpretations. No, but you just made a claim. You said he's hold, like, why can't he be holding? I'm back saying his it speed? could be this, just like you're saying it, it should be. It no, could I'm be saying this. it literally is this because nothing disproves no, it. No, yeah, yeah, your reason for saying it is. And Naruto like, feels inferior to Gara. You said, why would I be going any slower? I'm substantiated by showing that Naruto feels inferior to Gara. Whether or not you feel like it matters because he has seen semi trans from Gara isn't the case. He feels inferior to Gara, period. He doesn't and, feel like and he him. All, all, all he's seen from Gara is Gara, like uh, Gara in the arena. When it's like Gar doesn't perform, and that's worse. That means he arena, finds right? a weaker hold guard on, on, and somebody transforms him. All he's seen is Gar in the arena when Gar is just getting like folded by Sasuke, and uh, even at, before that, he's literally scared of Gar already because of Gar. Just like he's scared of Gar because of Gar's mental state, right? And he's because also afraid because Gar, Gar will fuck him up, murder people whenever he feels like. Hold on, he's scared of Gar before, like when Gar walks down the hallway and murders two shinobi. He's just scared of Gar's ability to just mindlessly slaughter. Not just not his actual stats, and he's also right. afraid of his overall abilities. Otherwise, why would when, why would, when wait, is hold that shown? Because he says I don't feel like I can beat him. Why would that be from? Why would he say okay, like? Okay, oh, and I showed so that. Yeah, and the only reason, or the only thing that because he's always been scared of Gar, right? Up until this point, he's still been scared of Gar. He makes a similar statement before he ever sees Gar in the actual fight. Naruto watched Gar. And Rock, no, hold on, Gar, and he literally watched Rock Lee and Gar fight. And that was after. That was before he met. Guard doesn't do anything in that, in that fight. What? You said what? He isn't scared of Guard in that fight. But he was still. He has some measure to make note from. That's what I'm saying. He sees. Yeah, Gar but that doesn't. Ability. But what he sees then doesn't make him scared. What makes him scared of Guard and think that he's inferior to Guard is Guard's ability to just murder people. When he sees him in the hallway with the two Jones, he was just he, Hank, he like just was with Zabuza and Haku. <laughs> Why would he be is scared it, okay, of a murderer? Scared of bloodlust. Zaba, That's my point huh? Huh? The two niggas who was Zabuza, out here hold on, hold on. people for money? Hold on, actually, you just brought up the perfect example. Because with Zabuza and Haku, 
Naruto and Sasuke are both scared, like like peeing their pants, just because of Zabuza's raw bloodlust. And, and they're still and they're still willing to fight them. Naruto doesn't want to no, fight them. Not, it couldn't just be from like, fear. Sasuke, hold on, Naruto is to an extent just like he is with Gara. He's still willing to fight Gara. And then even then, the, even though like what you're trying to imply it doesn't go with the scene, he says, "I don't feel like I can beat him." He would have to be making a measurement of his stats versus Gara. Wouldn't it just be from the fear? Because that scene that, doesn't. That's show exactly that. what happened. Okay, hold on. And I'm saying that his basis for that. Doesn't come from Gar seeing Gar in a fight, because we know when he's seeing Gar in a fight, this doesn't make him scared of Gar. He what was literally actually, he no, watched no, no, Gar and Sasuke fight. Scared of Gar, Gar and Lee. No, 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 no. He has a measure to make no, no, no. note. What makes him scared of Gar is the bloodlust. Like, because he doesn't try to end. He doesn't try to end Sasuke's fight based off of like Gar. Like, I don't know, like being scared. What he ends because because he literally tells Sasuke to yeah go full Gar, right? When he sees Gar murder two, two um tuning in the hallway, that's when he says Sasuke he can't win this fight. He can't beat this fight. So before why would some why would some wait hold on? So if someone's weak but a killer, I'm gonna be scared of him. Uh, bloodlust, literally fear asking people. Yes. Hell no! If this nigga can't even pick up a pebble and he's a school shooter, I'm about to piss my pants. <laughs> that's like, all. That's all. Like, what I'm saying is right. Feeling, like that's consistent for Naruto. I, I disagree. Even, like, I think. Is a fight. Hold on, hold on. I, if, because Naruto visibly, hold on, because Naruto visibly shows that he, that he thinks that Sasuke can fold Gar, right? Then the only difference between these two scenes, between like Naruto meeting Sasuke and like Kakashi in the arena when they first pull up, and then Sasuke running to the arena to tell Kakashi to call off the fight because he doesn't think Kaka Gar can beat Sasuke, or that, because he doesn't think Sasuke can beat Gar. The only difference between these two is when he actually gains the fear of Gar, is seeing Gar murder two people in the hallway. And I also say with the he had a whole conversation with Shikamaru like, when they're ninja. crying on the steps in the corner, like just whining. They're talking about how Gar can just murder people like that. How he just has like that look in his eyes that he just that just allows to murder. All right, let me show you this too. So what actually instills the fear into Naruto is his murder, his blood. I would murder. argue it's a combination of both. Okay, but okay, show me that like he ever gets scared of Gar's like actual steps. He's literally because he's only he, shown. If I say I can't wait, hold on. So the statement, I don't feel like I can beat this guy. Wouldn't it be better to say I'm scared shitless of this nigga who is a school shooter mentality? Because he doesn't say that before. He doesn't just say that he's scared. He states that Sasuke. He's stating this he now because he actually murder. has to fight Gara. Why would he state no, it before? Debo, okay, Debo, hold on. No, he makes the statement that Sasuke can't beat Gara. Only based off of the sole fact that Gara has just shown the reason to murder. No, I'm not he saying. I'm not referring murder. to that. What I shown is Naruto it, stating, it. "I don't feel like I, I can be." I understand it. I understand it so better, like so you can like better understand my point. All right, I don't think you. like they're understanding. Also, even in, um, wait, no, I'm gonna wait till like you show this. I don't want to start. I don't want to shotgun you. Okay, this is the first one showing that like Sas or that Naruto thinks that Sasuke can win against Gar. He thinks that Sasuke can beat Gar. This is the first one, right? Then wait, you're wait. What did you say? This is and then like they're like hurrying up to go watch the fight. Then this is when they like see Gar murder these two shinobi in the hallway. So wait, even so after he's had multiple wait, interactions with Gar, when he and Shikamaru are both ready to throw down with Gar, right? They're, they've ready like they've had like a throw down with Gar already. Like, okay, wait, hold then on. They see so Gar murder this... two people, and this is when they actually like begin to get scared of Gar. Wait, hold on. So you they've said already you made had a, a direct interaction with Gar where they were about to fight, right? They were both willing to fight Gar. Then okay, wait, hold on. Before murder, you continue, now right? Scared of him. You're so saying you're Gar saying that um, Naruto stays they've had an interaction with Gar in the hospital where they were willing to take down Gar, but guy does interrupt, right? So they've seen Gar fight already, but only after he murders two shinobi does does Naruto ever state that they can't beat him. Prior, wait, one thing. I just want to get to this before I forget it. So you said Naruto states Sasuke could beat him, and Shikamaru states he had like say something similar supporting me. He wait, hold on, I've hold on. Can you hear me? Who kills so automatically? Even Sasuke better watch out. Yikes! Wait, can you hear what I'm saying? They're referencing his, they're referencing like his killing intent, like his, like his bloodlust. His, he's just like willing to just murder people like that. Wait, That's on. what they're hear, referencing. Can you hear me? Hello. Yes, I can hear you, Debos. 
What the fuck's up I, with your name? Can I? I just like it. But um, Asaru, can you hear me? No. I don't think you can. Oh, can y'all let him know? Asaru, can, yeah. can you hear him? So you know, I think Asaru's fucked What's up. What's the debate, D-Boss? Oh, Chewing Exam Neji versus Chewing Exam Sasuke. All right, and I'll, get, I'm I'll go watch the thing that I need. I'll go, I'm you gonna go watch trying to get all off the fight after what he's seen with Gar. All right, okay, I'm can you hear me now, Asaru? I do, not, I do not think he can hear me. <laughs> Hello, Asaru, could you? I'm dumb. Yes. Yeah, I think he's go to Asaru's server. Let's go watch it. Oh, I, had my, I had my speaker. Yo, D-Boss, can I get a happy late birthday? It was my birthday Friday. Got you. Happy birthday, homie. Thank you. Bro, I, I didn't hear if you were responding. I did not. No, yeah, I was. Trying, that's why I had to check. So I was like, low key, you, there's no way you're hearing me. I was about to say, um, you made a statement that like, uh, Naruto knows that Sasuke can beat like uh Gara. Or he he makes a statement that says like he thinks like Sasuke can, or he like tells Sasuke go ahead and win against this guy. He says no. What you what you showed me is like you um don't you dare lose to a guy like him. That doesn't mean like he feels like Sasuke would win. He's just being like a um, a friend. Like my friend could feel like I'm gonna get bodied, but. He's like, don't you fucking lose, dude. Like, you better get okay, that dub. But, yeah, but uh, hold on. it still shows a difference in Naruto's, like, view on the fight. Because he goes from saying that Sasuke can still, like, still compete in this fight from wanting to call the entire thing off. Wait, why does that show that Naruto feels like Sasuke can win? He's just hyping I, him I, up. Hold on, I, I'm not saying, like, even if it doesn't show that he thinks he can win, he still shows a difference in Naruto's view on the fight. He goes from saying that Sasuke can fight or can, like, at least compete in this fight. From wanting to call the entire thing off because he doesn't think. Sasuke and then also, you asked me to show that um Naruto like shows fear, right? Like shows um like he doesn't want to fight Gar before this. Uh yeah. Yeah wait, I think I got I think I got that. You remember the hospital scene where he files like I don't want to fight this guy. Uh, I I don't remember him saying that during the hospital. I got you. I'm about to find it. If not, then I'm wrong. <laughs> I think I got it. I remember them both willing to fight it. He literally punches Gar in his face in the hospital. Like, did they like catch Gar? No, wait. Let me show you. Um, and I like find the full thing too. If you want like the full context, because I want to like fucking have truth. Like this is like literally him shaking in fucking fear, and he's like, "There's just no way that we can win against him." So they they're definitely like not willing to fight him still, and he feels inferior to him. Like this is after he's already like punched him in his face. Well, yeah, he only punched him in his face like save weed. That was like a sneak attack, right? It's not like you have to like keep fighting him because shadow, um, the shadow thing will, like hold Gara. Right? And he says like, "There's no way like people like this exist." Yeah, what and then he says, "There's just no way we can win against him." Why would a mentality affect a fight? Right? And I just, I literally just showed you that. Like, and no, what I'm saying is, if Gara was weaker, no, 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 right? No, 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 no. I literally just showed you when he references like Sasuke. He thinks that Sasuke can fight against Gara. Okay, and what I'm saying is that panel you showed me does not say that. He has hopes that Sasuke can win this fight with Gar. Then he takes a complete 180 after only see, like the only difference is he's seen Gar kill. And Shikamaru also makes a statement that backs it up because what they're referencing here is not just Gar being a strong person. He Shikamaru also states the same thing. He said, "I've never seen someone kill so automatically." Even okay, Sasuke and that's fine. He can be bloodlusted, right? He can be a bloodthirsty fuck. And also be a strong bloodthirsty. But fuck, that, which I'm is saying that the reason for their fear is because of his bloodthirst. You're saying and what I'm showing, and what I showed in the panel is he doesn't note the fear. He's saying I can't beat this dude. He's making a okay. message of him and versus think, the other okay. guy. And I'm saying that the reason for wanting to not fight Gar is because of his bloodlust. Okay, so we basically just gave two valid interpretations to go with. No, but yours is okay. What backs up it be, be it being because of Gar's strength? Because when he makes the like, statement like, of him not being able to on, beat him, he never it, brings up the, the fear thing. thing. Hold on, no, 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 hold on, hold on. I'm explaining something. Because my interpretation is backed up by one of Shikamaru's statement that implies it, and Sasuke's or Naruto's view on the fight changing after just seeing Gar's bloodlust, right? Not Gar having good stats, and not Gar being a strong person. It's after he sees Gara murder two people, he, after he sees his blatant bloodlust, he says Sasuke can't fight him, that he must call this fight off. So my interpreta t interpretation is backed up by Naruto's views on the, like, view on the fight. Well, he never so actually states that Sasuke could that beat him. He just tells Sasuke, don't no, you dare he lose. That Sa he thinks that, like, he still allows, basically what he's saying is that Sasuke can fight Gara. Not not, not that's even not what he, he what? Win. That's not what he's he, what, saying. He that's, what you're, that's what you're telling me. That's not what the scene he says. He said Sasuke. He, he thinks that like Sasuke has like the hope of beating Gar. What? What? Wait. From what you? Okay, you're talking about the stairwell. He says Sasuke, you better not lose this. So he doesn't state that like he still thinks that. Sasuke oh, okay. Yeah. Gar. He never states that thing. You're making an assumption. That's not what the panel says. He states that Sasuke, you better not lose to him. 
What do you, okay. That's exactly what it says. That's just a friend hyping a friend up. Why does that mean he feels so, like... Okay, and I'm saying that after seeing Gar murder someone, he states that he has to call the fight exact off. same thing. Isn't he fucking sweating? He's sweating. He's literally, like, showing sweat, talking to Sasuke about Gara. I'm not saying that he isn't still scared. d -Boss, you're not understanding my... No, what I'm saying is the fear tells, would have to be no, a combination no, 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 okay, of his I, abilities. I you're understanding the point. d -Boss, he tells Sasuke to still fight Gara, right? Then, uh, do you agree? Right? He still thinks that Sasuke... He can't stop Gaara Sasuke here, from right? doing it. Hold on. Yeah, hold on. He's not stopping Sasuke from doing it here, right? So he's willing to let Sasuke fight Gara right here, right? And he's also sweating bullets while telling him, no, no, but okay, no, no, just continue. Answer my, just answer my question, because I'm trying to go down my point, because I don't think you're understanding it. Okay. He's willing to let Sasuke fight Gara here, right? Okay. Then, after, the only difference between these two versions of Naruto, right? Because he doesn't even see any of the fight, because he's sitting in a hole. So it's not after seeing Gara perform in a fight. It's after seeing Gara just have this blatant, like, a huge amount of bloodlust. Does he state that Sasuke cannot fight anymore? He cannot fight Gara. It's that doesn't just mean that it's not referring to his abilities as a fighter, too. Fight. You're just showing me, like, it's an added thing of, like, his mentality. But I'm saying that that's the only, that's what's stated. It doesn't and what I'm showing, and what I'm telling you is that's not what's shown with, like, every scene that they mention, like, inferiority. Like, when Naruto mentioned inferiority to Gara. Okay, when is it stated because of his stats that he's... That he's it doesn't have to be flat out stated. It could be implied from the scene. Okay, from what scene does it say? The scene where I sent where he says, I don't feel like I could beat this guy. He's not okay, remarking on anything else. Stats? He would have to be making a measurement of, of his stats versus Gara. Why is he referencing his stats? Because he also says that he can't that Sasuke can't beat Gara because of his bloodlust. So I've given a statement with context when they state you can't beat somebody, it can also be a reference because of bloodlust. Where does he what? state that where does he state that like he can't where, beat, uh, Sasuke Gaara, can't beat him because of his bloodlust? In reference to Gara, where does Naruto ever make a statement that because of his stats he can't beat him? I'm saying that the scene implies it from when I showed you. Okay, what, what? All you said is that he can't beat him, and then you said, therefore, he's referencing stats. I asked you why I'm saying it would imply his stats, because the state... What I'm saying is, that scene shows nothing else. It doesn't state that he's afraid, uh, and, and that's the only reason why. It doesn't state that he's afraid when he's telling Sasuke to call off the match, either. We literally see him sweating. That implies that he feels fearful of even talking no, about that, Gara. No, but that's not what he states. Okay, that's not what he states there. He's also sweating so, when he's telling Gara, when he's saying it the first time. That he's okay, hold on. So that just means Naruto is just fucking saying shit that he doesn't, like, his body isn't representing properly. What? That, okay, he can be scared in both instances, but why is that his read? Like, why is his fear of Because if it's just mentality, it wouldn't stats? matter if Gar isn't a strong opponent. Mentality wouldn't dictate okay, that. I'm saying that it shows... Hold on, he already knows of Gar's capabilities in a fight, but that isn't his reason that's called, to tell Sasuke to call off the match. He so feels like Sasuke... Point, he he feels like Gar would be an individual to try to kill him. Still, hold on. At this point, he already knows of Gar's capabilities, but that still doesn't stop him from saying, like... Like Sasuke, go go fight. But hold on, fight. in the exact panel you sent me, where he's telling like Sasuke to fight, he's sweating, so he feels nervous about it anyway. Yes, so he's already. I don't. I'm not agreeing that he's that he's not already scared of Gar, but he's still willing to. Let no, I'm not answer. saying at this moment Naruto's like speaking of history, right? He's nervous for Sasuke. Because why well, well, is he I sweating, feel, telling Sasuke I don't to go know if fight? He's nervous for Sasuke. I think he's just nervous because of Gar. Because he says, yeah, don't you dare lose him. And then he literally showed Naruto. Naruto's like fucking sweating, bro. He's literally sweating, thinking about like Sasuke interacting with like Gara. Uh, so that's why I'm saying like both interpretations would be showing, valid. But either way, like, it's, like, he can still be like scared for the fight, but he still has the willingness to let the fight continue. Well, but he only, hold on, he only had the willingness to let the Gaara's fight continue blood, because he had no other gone. option, right? He had no other option, and he was even losing the fight. That, and the only time he true, beats he Gara tell, no, is with the mental. He shows amp. that he's willing to tell Kakashi to cut off the fight if needed. So it's okay, not you're talking about the Kakashi fight. Another option. Okay, what I'm saying is that doesn't imply it's just in reference to his mentality. You're not showing me a singular thing. I'm saying it can be interpreted Ebos, I'm saying as a combination in the of both. I've given the only difference between these two scenes is Gara's bloodlust that makes like Saz or that makes Gar or that makes Naruto weigh the fight. It's only his bloodlust that makes him reweigh the fight. And his overall stats and abilities. Otherwise, no, the show that it's his matter. overall stats in his context. I'm saying it's implied from within the scenes. If someone's scary but weak, why would I be worried about them? Why would I be worried and about them? And I just showed you him? why, bro. I just and showed you know, why what I'm Naruto saying is, right? Is showing, no, your interpretation. Naruto is showing the way to fight differently because of Gara's bloodlust. Your interpretation you can be valid, right? What I'm saying is my interpretation is not less valid than yours. There's you're giving, nothing, an, you're giving an assumption it. on the scene just like I am. Because then the same thing you told me where he states Sasuke. I've showed you that there's nothing different between, like, it's not Gar, like, it's not Naruto witnessing Gar fight differently. It's not like, like, him witness Gar's stats. 
is them witnessing his blatant bloodlust is why Naruto now thinks that Sasuke, who he was willing to let fight Gara, can no longer fight Gara at all. And what I'm saying is, in the, st- in the scene I showed lust. you, there's no mention of the bloodlust. It's only mention of, I that, can't beat this there guy. Is mention of the it would only have to be in a measure of stats. They, they do mention the bloodlust, that's not true. They mention the bloodlust later. I'm talking about within that scene. Within the scene that I showed. Not later on, just that scene alone. I've never met anyone who killed so automatically. Even Sasuke better watch it. So you telling me, so wait, what, so Gara was he a... Says, well, what per, he he references Gara's team. He says, for what person do I exist? Why am I alive? While I continue to live, I need a reason. I exist to kill all humans other than myself. Wait, so Asher. So Gara, hold on, when he references Gara murdering people, he gets he gets up instantly and state he must stop the fight. Okay, so now I'm going to ask you a question, right? If, if he was weak as fuck, but intimidating, do you think Naruto would still be worried about the fight? That's not my, okay, Debo, uh, why are I'm you like, asking. I'm asking because it goes with my point. I'm not disagreeing that, like, in the case that, like, Gara has absolutely no, like, he's just the weakest person on earth, they would be scared of a death. Okay, so what I'm saying is you right. agree with me. No, it could be a 50-50 of both. you're not understanding the point because you're using that to say that Gara just must be strong. No. You keep trying to take one half of my, like, one half of my agreement and run away I'm with not. You. If you're not saying, if Gara was weak as fuck or weaker than Naruto or Sasuke, the mentality would not be an issue because why would he do it? But I'm saying that it is shown that he weighs to fight differently because of the mentality. And what I'm saying when is the mentality ever, has no, to on, go no, no, with no, something. No, no. I can want to be president, but if I don't have the drive to do the things that require to become president... Based off of his bloodlust, show me Naruto ever say, like ever weighing Gara's stress. Why do I need to... I'm already showing you why that would be the case. No, that's circular. Because I've already gave my explanation. The argument for it is circular. I asked you to show me an instance. You said this is it right here. So I have to show you a specific instance of him only speaking of Gar's stats. Yes, ever referencing Gar's stats for why they're scared of Gar. And then I asked you the question, why would he be afraid of someone who's weaker than him? As an opponent, he weighs him based off of his bloodlust. You say here is just his stats there because he states. I'm, I didn't say just. I literally said later on it could be a combination of both. That's fine with me. Okay, uh, it's uh, not uh, just uh, one. Yeah, you, you didn't say both. Hold on, you didn't say only. I'm sorry. You said that he is referencing Gara's stats, or he can be referencing Gara's stats. But I showed you why when they weigh Gara, or when Naruto has weighed Gara's opponent, we we haven't seen it ever reference his stats, or at least at this one. And I what I'm you, saying is a mentality without the ability to accomplish the task is not, it doesn't work. If I want to become a but that's fucking not mayor. He that he can't be, I'm, I'm saying that, like, okay. what I'm saying is his fear of battle with Gara comes from his bloodlust. Wait, hold on. Let me ask you a question, right? If you wanted to be something, but you didn't do anything for it, would I be worried that you, like, want to be fucking Hitler if you're not doing anything to be Hitler? Bro. Like, You're not scary then. That's all I'm saying. If Michael Myers wants to kill niggas, okay, okay, okay. Now let's say <laughs> I don't know. It's like you not getting. If I murder thirty thousand people, are you gonna be scared if I get into a fight with your friend? If you murder thirty thousand people and you have the means to murder my ass, yes, I'm scared. Okay. So what he states is that, like, I don't, like, I don't know, like, how you, like, like, where this is going. What I'm saying is the mentality like, would have to correlate to Gar's no, abilities. I'm also. saying that, like, hold on, no, I'm saying that he, Gar can still be strong. Sure, you're not just going to say that like Gar, like Gar's not some like some weak person. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that his reason for being scared of Gar doesn't come from his stats. It comes. You already from agreed the that he could be strong too. I already said why would a mentality be scary without the ability to actually but that's accomplish what, but what that's you what's want. Shown. It's shown that like a guard, like a guard stats don't change between the, like a, okay at this point, right? Well, guard, arguably like, he would be greater than the fight with Leaf has already change. said he that's absorbed blood. Like, that's why I brought up this instance because it proves my point exactly. Like a guard stats don't change. He he doesn't get any faster. He doesn't get any stronger. Or at least not that Naruto knows, right? He doesn't get any stronger. He doesn't get any faster, right? His stats don't change. But Naruto gets scared of a fight with him based off of this bloodlust. And also would have to correlate to stats with the examples that I okay, gave. Okay, but Naruto doesn't see Gara's stats change. He doesn't need... It doesn't matter if Gara stayed the same or gotten stronger. The point is, is that he's afraid of him for this combination of things. Because you can't have but a mentality show, but, okay, that doesn't but, correlate but, with the drive to actually accomplish it. Show me that he was scared of his stats. Being afraid of someone being bloodthirsty and not being... And, and they're weak doesn't make it, sense. That's, that's what Shikamaru states as well. They say, I've never seen someone just kill like that. So that's fine. That's fine. What I'm saying is that if I have a mentality of a school shooter but ain't shoot up no damn schools, what are you scared of me for? That don't make sense. You have but to have the actual abilities to do what you're saying. Just, it's not that just Gar is just willing to... It's, like, it's not just the fact that Gar is willing to kill, right? 
Okay, so that's fine. Gar just, it's just it could be Gar both. That's what like I'm saying. Nothing, right? They just know that Gar has like huge bloodlust. Like, like if this dude has a reputation for shooting people, right? That, that I'm going to be scared of like it. Like maybe he might shoot me. Right? And Naruto's <laughs> watching Gar in action, and he's like, "Yeah, I don't think I could beat this guy. It couldn't just be the." No, he isn't watching him in action at this point. We already he's watched him fight Lee point. and fight Sasuke. No, no, he, what he watches? The, no, he doesn't watch. No, he does not watch the Sasuke fight. He comes he in at the end when Chidori happens. He doesn't watch that fight. So he doesn't. So he you're saying, wait, when does he the leave? Lee fight. Yeah, he watches the Lee fight, but he isn't like scared to say like he can't like can bat him at all. Wait, hold on. So in the Sasuke fight, when are you saying he leaves? What Naruto was he watching up like, until the Chidori? What he comes in at the Chidori? They were sitting in the hallway after watching Gara kill two people. I literally saw when, when Naruto comes back. It's just like instantly. What are you talking about? Just looking. It's just I sent <laughs> it. That's when Naruto comes back to the arena. He's sitting in the hallway on the staircase with Shikamaru having a conversation about Gar's bloodlust. They aren't watching the fight. Naruto runs in the arena as Sasuke has his arm to Gar's sand barrier. He's not sitting there spectating the fight. Let me see. Just make sure I'm remembering this correctly. That's why Lee even says, yo, Naruto, what's up? Like, Lee, who had already been there since then, like, was Lee not there from the No, Lee comes after Okay, yeah, like Lee, that's fine. Literally just yeah, that's fine if Naruto wasn't like, like there to witness it. What I'm saying is the mentality has to go with the abilities to accomplish it. He only that's fine. One fight. What I'm saying is a mentality without the ability to accomplish it doesn't matter. That's that's what I'm but saying. That's what scares like, him. It, and we're going like we're basically just going like circular at this point. I'm not like gonna concede. But okay, but I feel like my interpretation okay, is valid. But there's nothing that backs up that guards like stats is what scares him. What I'm saying is a mentality has to be backed up by yeah, the ability you, you to do it. You just keep repeating the same interpretation of it. But okay, I and I'm backing up. it up with no, what I'm no, telling you and what I'm showing you from within the scene. Yourself. So, like, I, I don't know what else to tell you at no, this point. No, without no, just no, going, no. Like, unless you I just repeat there, There's myself. no evidence from the series for it. You're just backing it up with another statement from No, because I wouldn't say I don't feel like I could beat this guy because he's fucking gay. Like, that doesn't make sense. I don't care if you want to keep repeating what you think should be Okay, so we can just go to conclusions because we really just... You are told me the same thing eight times. keep saying that, like, yeah, well, I wouldn't be like, okay, I don't care. Okay, that's fine. You don't have to, like, you don't have to care, right? What I'm saying is my interpretation, I feel, is valid. I feel like I defend my point. We can just go to conclusions. but what you think, but sure. We can go to conclusions. That's cool. Because we're basically just, like, ad nauseum at this point. Yeah, yeah, fine. I, I'll, like, give Neji scale, like, we, we don't have this, like, we can conclude this point. I'll give my, like, my Neji scale. But first yeah. off, I'm just saying, like, my, uh, yeah, I, I don't think there's, like, anything from the actual series or anything else that, like, backed up my opponent's point. I think it was just, like, him repeating that, like, he thinks this should be the case or, like, based off of, like, his own personal view on it. And Whereas, evidence so, from I the series. That Naruto's, uh, what? And uh, I was using the manga panels. Back yeah, which followed it. I said, how, like, yeah, we already went into like how that doesn't like or how that falls into. No, I'm just making sure you quote what I show in my part. You can continue. Yeah, I, I know you used like, yeah, he used that statement. I said, yep. what shows that Naruto, like, what shows that Naruto's ever scared of, like, the uh, and Naruto's then I explained that also, like this or the combination. What Saitama, I that also. Saitama Solo is Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> what? Okay. Yo, is that it? The baby. Crazy how, the like, baby. Okay, in the reference baby. to this, like, okay, I brought up that, like, Naruto was <laughs> shown to wait, like, he does, like, he, he's shown the way Gar as a fighter based off of his bloodlust, right? They're not saying Gar is completely incapable, right? Gar, they can still <laughs> view Gar as, like, strong. Debate me. But it's really Debate me, Saito. They cannot defeat Gar, or they just, like, scared to fight Gar, or scared for someone fighting him, comes from his, like, bloodlust, right? So Gar, like Gar, could have been like slightly but Naruto. Like I, none of this matters, right? Gar could have had like whatever stats he has, but Naruto was scared because of bloodlust. And Shikamaru says the exact same thing, which directly backs up my interpretation, of it, right? Because Shikamaru, like they're both fine with willing, like they're willing to let Sasuke fight Gar, right? But shit, like they stay after watching Gar murder two people. And that's it. Like that's the only thing that happens in between these scenes, right? Gar killing people. They state now that Sasuke like absolutely cannot fight. Cannot fight Gar, and it also follows from whenever Naruto go like runs into the arena to stop Sasuke, he references back or he thinks back to when Gar thinks he's just gonna murder everyone on this planet or like something along them lines. He just thinks like he he exists to kill everyone. After referencing that statement from Gar, he gets up and goes to stop Sasuke. 
So it's like literally like completely backed up by the story that's just Gara's bloodlust, Gara's bloodlust, statement from Shikamaru, statement from Gara, flashback like to a statement from Gara, statement from Naruto, like all of it's backed up by it being bloodlust and nothing supports it being stats besides D-Ball's like own interpretation of how it should be. I'm done. Okay. Um, so basically I've in my conclusion. I'm saying that I've backed up the fact that a mentality has to be like substantiated by the like means to do it. If someone wants to be mayor, but they don't show any capabilities of becoming the mayor, then no one's going to fucking take them seriously. I don't think fear can only be based off like a mentality. And I shown like the scan of Naruto stating I can't beat him. And he doesn't mention anything about like his mentality in that. He's like literally just saying, I don't feel capable of fighting this individual, this opponent. So with that, I'm just saying that it shows inferiority to Gara at this present time, who Sasuke would scale to. And, um, yeah, basically, pretty sure I heard everything I said. I repeat, like, eight fucking times. So, yeah, that's my conclusion. Hello? Who's the judge? I don't even know. I don't even care. Um, Neji just stated, uh, like, a, like, just, he just stated to be the strongest Gideon in Kona, badly. Isn't that prior Which to the Naruto and Neji fight? Um, yeah, it's like a month before him. Yeah. Okay, so why would that correlate with after the Naruto and Neji fight? I, I didn't say it correlate. Like what? I, I'm so saying it, it puts Neji. It puts Neji above Lee, who scales to Sasuke. Okay, I don't wait. So it you're showing me a you're saying Lee's statement before Sasuke comes back from training. It puts him above Lee. What? Uh, what? Oh, okay. Sasuke then compared to uh, Lee okay. in the I don't, I don't disagree with Neji being greater than Lee. Okay, and I think I've already scaled like Lee to Sasuke already. So. Okay. So, that's so, 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 so. Uh, like, do you think you like showed anything for Sasuke being faster than Lee? I feel like I did. Okay. Then, yeah. Then we don't have anything else. Like gentle fist, like during the gates and nights. Yeah. That's basically all my shit. Um. Also, like, I just feel like you know, like QB Amp is able to react to like attacks from Shikaku, right? QB Amp is able to react to attacks from Shikaku. Yes. When, um, here I'll, I'll show. Up. Whenever he goes like QBM, like running down Chicago's arm, he like dodges an attack from Chicago, like uh, like a basically like a sand arm from Chicago. Okay, that Naruto like is mental amp. He has like an established okay, mental. He's, he's also mental amped against um. Not I disagree. Him. He's not mental up against. He stated. Okay, that's fine. He stated by Genma to be mental amped. When fighting Neji. Yes. Show me. I'm getting it now. Yo, Vermillus. Mm. Here we go. In the bottom left, he says he was getting pummeled, but he never lost faith in his own ability, in his ability to win, and he never stopped planning his next move. Naruto knows instinctively that believing in yourself can give you the power to change your destiny. Why does this mean he was... Wait, so you're saying that from, like, this dude's, like, interpretation of the fight, that is vague and like it's meaning you can mean like literally a non-literal mental amp of just like naruto just didn't give up not giving up isn't a mental amp yeah, that's not what he states though he says he gains more power and then why is this ninja reliable and like the amps that ninjas would get uh, like who is this nigga God. okay we're just gonna waste time doing that i'll, I'll just get there i'm, I'm asking because if i said it you, you wouldn't be like okay. oh yeah this is okay valuable. okay like i think i've like already went over this before right Ninja, like, one, Gemma's the proctor, so he would show, he would know if Naruto is showing higher feats than before, for one, right? Gemma, who's spectating their fight, literally the closest to their fight, would know if Naruto's performing better than before. And then, oh wait, and hold on, also, her, right? And he references the fact that Naruto goes from getting bullied to being able to take down. He only beats Neji due to Kurama, that's not a mental <laughs> He literally what? uses the nine tails. Okay, but that's not this. Okay, that's not. And then he beats Neji, Gemma right? Finally, by sneak that's attacking this, that's him. That's not what's stated by Gemma to be the only thing that allows him to win. No, what I'm saying is, in the context of the fight, we literally see what happens. It doesn't matter what the fuck okay, Gemma says Gemma if the fight doesn't Naruto substantiate what you're power. trying to say he's saying. Okay, but Gemma still says that Naruto gaining more power. It's what Liam referenced in the novel. He doesn't. <laughs> we literally see in the fight. And it's he also just stated by no, Haku that protecting something precious. He goes. Him, he goes into Nine Tails, right? He goes into Nine Tails. He then mm -hmm. sneak attacks Neji, which is just outplaying him. He just was tactical. What any of that is an amp? What like what what part of okay. that is mental amp? Because okay, and I'm saying that like a part of like it doesn't have to like show him having higher stats. We have two statements that give him higher stats, right? And we have the fact that he's just using a like a Karama. 
No, it just states that believing yourself can give you the power to change your own destiny, right? Believing, so what this means, right, in my interpretation, is that Naruto not believing himself to be a loser and working hard towards his goals allowed him to change his destiny of being, like, the village loser. That's all it is. It doesn't mean, like, a mental amp. Like, I don't, like... Okay, so if he just gained new power, what is it? Like, where, where is he getting his power? What, what new power is this guy? What is it? What does it say? Gain new... It literally... All it says here is that... Can give yourself, you the power. Okay, no, you just say give you more. Give you more. <laughs> that's not like, That's not what he says. What? Can't give... Okay, if he didn't have... <laughs> he states believing in himself is what gave him the power. Okay, and what? Naruto believed himself not to be a loser made him train, and he changed his destiny of Neji believing he's a fucking loser. Okay, and so he's referencing that... that okay, so he's referencing that Naruto's ability to believe in himself during this fight gives him new strength. No, it's just Naruto training. That's just Naruto training and being strong at all. locking techniques. That's, That's not, not correlating to a mental amp. That's not what he says at all. Because the actual fight doesn't substantiate a mental amp. Yeah, and this can be interpreted all. differently. He doesn't state that at all. He doesn't state what at all. He, he doesn't state anything about like Naruto training. That, that has he was getting pummeled but never lost faith in his ability to win. And he never stopped planning his next moves. Naruto extinction knows that believing yourself gives you the power to change your own destiny. He doesn't say he got stronger. He just made a plan. Literally, like, gives him power. If you, if you want to say that power. my interpretation isn't valid, it's literally just saying Naruto never gave up and thought of a plan to beat Neji. That's not a but, mental yeah, amp. Hold on. He said, gave him power. Why are you ignoring the last part? It gave him the power to change his destiny. What was okay, Neji saying his destiny fight. was? You, we literally said it was being like the village loser. Losing exactly. So he changed that destiny of being a loser by thinking of a plan to whoop Neji's That's ass. That's not what he says. That doesn't matter what he says. It's what the scene, like literally the so, context of the fight. So you're referencing this is what the statement says. That said, doesn't matter what he says. You're using the statement and saying the statement doesn't matter. I'm saying that. Oh, hold on. I'm saying that the actual fight itself lets us know what Naruto did to win. We literally see it. Gimma's statement or whatever the hell his name is is only saying Naruto believed himself. Never let him give up to try to win and think of a plan to win. He thought of a plan. That's to not win, which what he only says. Okay, you also said it gave him more That's power. That's not what he said either. I'm giving an Bro, interpretation. I, I, I literally explained why he said more power. I explained why I said he said more power. You're but it doesn't say more power, so you're just giving an oh, interpretation, oh, 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 and I'm giving one. Believing in himself gives him the strength to win. It gives it him the power to change his destiny. If it was given to him, that means he didn't already have it. That's why I said believing more. yourself. Like okay, so if I'm believing in myself, right? If he was, if, if like it gives you the power to change your destiny, it's just referring to like Naruto's natural ability to believe in himself no matter what. It's just saying generally, like that could be a general statement. It's not referring to like at this but he, moment. What he's saying is that, that wait, this wasn't happening. Hold on. He's saying that this wasn't the case before. He explained, he gives the whole statement, right? He says he was getting pummeled, but he never lost space in his own ability to win. He never stopped planning his next move because Naruto knows instinctively. Wait, hold on. Are you saying Naruto didn't believe in himself before this? That's not what I'm saying, but Gemma okay, says so he, he always this. believes in himself. Demo, shut up. I, you don't want to try to fucking go over and claim an interpretation, and, and I can't give like my own fucking or interpretation to it. No, not Come when on, bro. Not when I'm in the middle of reading something and explaining something, you ask me a question to say, "Okay, then no." What? Because you're telling me the same thing. Like, okay, I, I don't care if you think like okay, because you're, I don't think you're understanding. Me. You think I'm not understanding you? That doesn't give anybody the right to cut the other one off and start screaming over. The okay, I apologize for cutting. I apologize for cutting you off, Asher. You could finish. Hey. So like I was saying, it, it, this isn't an indefinite thing. No mental amps in Naruto. Like, this isn't like an every time thing. Right? So, no, not all cases that Naruto is believing him, so he just randomly gets a mental amp. This isn't an every time thing. That's why he states can give you the power to change your destiny. Right? But in this case, it should, like, definitely follow that, this, like, this is one of the cases where he is getting this power. And the reason that I stated more, when he doesn't say word for word more... Yeah, right, I wasn't just saying like that's what he says here, but I'm saying like that's what this statement implies. Because if it's something like, if he's being given power, that means it's something that he didn't have. That's why I stated more. He's getting power that he didn't have originally from believing in himself during his fight with Neji. What do you guys okay. still debate? That's everything. Yes. Okay, I already explained why like I disagree with it and gave my interpretation, so I'm not like gonna like, keep repeating myself. Okay, and sure. He's also protecting his vow to Hinata. He states the word Hokage, which is stated in the data book to make him stronger. Okay, he does that like at the end of the fight, and he's still relative to Neji. He doesn't win with that. I'm sure. So Neji's the, so the like, mental amp would like, be shitty. It wouldn't even like, be a good one. How are you able to like change the quantity of the mental amp because of when he says it? 
No, I'm saying he only says it when he actually like punches Neji, right? When they clash and he loses. Yeah. So he's still relative to Neji. Okay. Okay. Well, so it doesn't what I'm saying, saying is what I like, what I've given for like Neji's guard would make him above Neji. Attack from, Neji's still able to like defend and like continuously like block the attack from Naruto. Okay. What I'm saying is I already like gave my scaling or an explanation for my guard like scale above Neji. And I don't feel like repeating it. So like yeah. I gave my reasoning. I gave my explanations. Like, if I keep, I'm just like be repeating myself. Yeah, that, that's fine. I'm not asking you to do that. I was just finishing my scaling. If, like the last year refutations have done nowhere, bro. Nowhere fine. I'll just show him. Like, I take, I take a can show him like him dodging the um, the one tails attack. Wait, which one? You asked me like when Naruto and Neji was fighting. No, him dodging the the one tails attack. Like, oh, Chicago. okay, yeah. Did I already say that that would be like an established mental imp Naruto? Um, you, you said that you never showed why. Uh, because he's, he's a mental, he's mental imp game. literally when he starts like, okay, wait. He's mental imp before that point. He also runs point. out of chakra from that. Mental imp is, he literally states that this protecting others gives you the power like you wouldn't necessarily Yeah, he have. also That's states, when, like, three, he, he, he states himself that he's out of chakra from using the 2K, from using the Uzumaki barrage. And Gamma okay, and his want to protect his friends gave him more. That's yeah, all no, his want to protect him friends gave him the chakra for the Uzumaki barrage. He states after that he's out of chakra. Okay, what I'm saying is that mental imp is still consistent because it's established that the that mental imp exists. Show that he still got more chakra level because he still stated to be out of chakra after the mental imp. Show that he still got more chakra. Then he summoned Gamma Buta. He to be out of it. Then he summoned Gamma yeah, Buta. Did... Huh? Then he summoned Gamma Buta. Gamma doesn't come from his own chakra. He taps into the Nine Tails to summon that. Show me that he summoned Gamma Buta with the Nine Tails chakra. Yeah, I'll just show you that it's like stated they can't do that on his own. That's what Jawai's whole. Okay, I don't, is. I don't care. Like, I don't care about that, right? I, I want you to show me in that scene that he summons it using. Okay, the Okay, well, chakra. he is stated at his max to not be able to have. The I already said mental Gamma imp Buta. was just allowed Naruto to get okay, more chakra. After that mental imp, that he does not have any more chakra. No, because he literally does the fucking serious eye look. And then summons Gamabunta. Okay. What, wait. I don't... <laughs> are you talking about the series I look where he's like, he will get stronger? No, like, literally right before, um, what, what is fucking guard doing? The sand coffin shit? Are you talking shit? about when he's, like, thinking back to the Haku thing? Mm-mm. After that. Like, when fucking, uh, what form is this? When oh, guard sure. transforms into, like, full Shukaku and starts, like, fucking wrapping him up in, uh, the shits. Let me, let me look at it. No, never mind. Yeah, yeah, he does do the serious eye. Sure. Yeah, so what I'm saying is this would just be a... Like, he didn't summon him with the Nine Tails. Why? Like, where are you... Like, show me that Naruto has a capability to summon Gabibuto without tapping into the Nine Tails. I'm saying in this that's instance... Not with the, wait, hold on. Because that's not shown in the state of What I'm saying is normal Naruto, I don't give a fuck about him not being able to do it. Mental app Naruto just can't. Okay, but he no longer has the chakra for the... Like, and like, I already why, said why the mental... Naruto done? has this mental app consistently. <laughs> He he literally wants to protect his friends. Okay, he gets show me that. Show me that he still has it here. Where does it stay? He loses it. He thinks he's out of chakra. And then he summons Game of with no nine tails. Okay, show that that comes from his own body because it's stated they shouldn't be able. No, to hold do on. That. How else would he? So you already that, said it's not no. from the nine. You can't show me it's from the nine tails, right? No, I, I stated because Naruto would not have the capabilities to do that. You're saying because of the mental amp. I say that the mental amp is stated to run like he stated to lose his chakra, gain from this mental amp. Right, so his mental amp chakra is spent on the Uzumaki bar. The mental amp would then come back. The mental amp is this consistent thing. So show me that he gets it back. What? What? If he, you just agree, he has the serious eyes, right? The same serious eyes he used, like literally, when he was getting the mental amp. So it's there. It's right there. He could just be serious. Activate Karama. What? Show me him activating Karama. Okay, yeah, he doesn't like they don't show like Karama. That's a normal Naruto. I'm gave, talking about a mental amp Naruto, reasoning. so it's fine. That's the why it should why it would be Karama that like why it would be from the help of Karama. They summoned the nine that he summoned Gamabuta. One, that's the only reason that he knows how to summon Gamabuta because that's his training with Jiraiya. He only he's only taught how to use summoning by accessing Karama. So you'd have to show that one, he knows how to do this without accessing Karama, so he has the capabilities to. Because he isn't taught how to summon it on his own. It's just through the use of him using a nine tails chakra. Like, because uh, it's of greater quality, is it not? Isn't that like the reason yeah, but he, why he uh, yeah. using so the nine tails chakra? So his training with Jiraiya is accessing the nine tails chakra to summon Gamabuta. You know what I'm saying is, isn't the whole reason he's using the nine tails chakra because it gives him more chakras? That's, that's his training with Jiraiya. 
No, and what I'm saying, okay, so what I'm saying is, right, it's just he needs more. The mental health would allow but him to have show, more no, chakras. Show that he even is, he's never ta- show that he's taught how to do it regularly himself. Why does he need to be taught how to do it regularly? It's just the application does, of him using How does he chakra. know? How does he know how to do it then? If it takes using chakra and the mental amp, like I'm explaining, it gives know. him more chakra, he has the means to do it without Karama. He still Karama. has to know how to do the technique, D-Boss. What would be, wait, hold on. What would be the difference from using Karama for it and not use Karama? What would be, the, like, I don't get it. Because, uh, uh, hold on, hold on. Because all he knows, right, is that he needs, like, all he knows is that he needs the nine tails. He, he doesn't have to know why. He doesn't have to know that it's because of his lack of chakra. I don't think that's explained to him. All he knows is that what's stated from Dry is that he needs the nine tails to be able to summon Gamabuntu. Okay, well, I'll explain myself. Exactly I, think, like, told to. I don't want to, like, keep going into, like, where we just repeat each other. Yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on, hold on. Who's the judge, man? Uh, no. Uh, oh, you guys don't have judges? <laughs> you guys are just gonna... Just, just debate to oblivion? I don't know. Just, I don't just know debate into this. <laughs> Bro, you guys have been doing this forever, and you were... You've been doing this <laughs> for about 30 minutes, and a conclusion. <laughs> I've legit. Why are you guys concluding? What? Who's gonna game. decipher it? Who's gonna decipher the verdict? Uh, I recorded <laughs> this, so I think like I could just send it and like post it, and, like you know. Okay. So why is it so contending then? All right. Well, is there any more like points you got, Asaru? We can like end it here. Yeah, oh I'm God. sending. I'm sending <laughs> the thing right now. About like his statement for like using um. Got, yeah, like, I'm this bro. Karama Wait. Bring out, I'm a Bluetooth. Is D balls and Asaru still happening? Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> hey, bro. Bro, 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 bro. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go, Kevin. Can you DM me who wins? I'll DM you. Or actually, I just thought about this. I can like judge if both of you guys tell me your verdict or your conclusions fully. If I listen, if I decide to listen. What was that? Okay. We went to conclusions and then went right back into. It. <laughs> guys, you guys rebounded. No, we never. Is it serious to do that? But I think then? I think we just concluded on the point. Yeah. Yeah. What is that talking? Um. Hmm. Is it? I don't know. <laughs> Nigger. I don't know who it is. Damn. I want to tell you how to buy Mojito's, right? Yeah, I don't, I don't know who it is. We can say no, don't judge for us. Oh, okay. Can you be vocal? What was it? Can you be vocal? It's unfunny. Can you not? Okay. <laughs> this this know, is yeah, our community. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't get the fun of being like weird in a mic. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I didn't even know. That's so weird. Mm. Why, bro? I don't <laughs> get it. I don't get it, bro. Dude, if I, I didn't even like consider me. Permits to ban him. This has to be like it has to be some major clout to be gained from just looking retarded. He got to be in the like, video. video. He wants to be in the Devo's video. No, I just you have a YouTube like, yeah. devils? What he is gumbo? Yeah, I do. It's my name. They don't show seven. like nine tail chakra. And okay. I'm about to see myself up there in the next Wait, few days. It'll be tragic. Sound kind of low. Mm. Um, I said um, hold on. I said when he like whenever he summons gumbo blue to the first time, they don't show like um nine tail chakra in in wrapping her word like coming out easier. So just because you're saying like it doesn't come out this time, therefore it, like it isn't his like nine tails chakra. No, I'm saying like nothing in the scene implies, and we have like this established. Uh, yeah, I'm saying yeah, nothing in the specific scene states so, but we know that he's taught in it like in the way to like summoning Gamabuta, he's taught to use like do it via unlocking Karama. Okay, I'm saying in my interpretation, he's using the mental amp that's already established. Okay, he's using that to just get more chakra. Show me that he still has enough chakra. For me it's never stated it. he lost the mental amp. No, he, he still he, he runs out of chakra. No, literally, when before he like when he gets the mental amp, they refer to Haku and he state like to protect others, you can become as strong as needed. So his want to protect others will be consistent because not because Sakura and okay, Sasuke I'm, I'm not are still he in danger. Still amp, but he still runs out of chakra. He, he, okay, and like, then he would just gain back amp, more. It's like an infinite chakra bar. I'm not saying infinite. I'm just saying that he would the mental amp will give him access to more. Well, yeah, it gives him access to chakra. I'm not disagreeing, but he runs out of the chakra game from the mental imp. 
And no, what I'm saying is that consistent. The mental has never stated to leave. He Holy has to, want to protect fuck. his friends and family. He sta- uh, yeah, but he stated to run out of the chocolate that he had. Okay, okay, I already said what I said, bro. He, Yo, he D- gets D- like D- Bo, Like your is argument your... is saying that he just Listen. like he just had like some infinite level of chocolate. That's not what I'm saying. I'm not. Bro, saying I think you guys have closed it up right now. I don't think this is going the on. The mental like gives him chocolate, but he runs out of what he gained from the mental end. Okay, well, I'm gonna just explain it one more time. I'm yeah, saying his, I'm saying, no, he I'm wants to scan, save Sasuke and, and Sakura. Just, just he gets scan, more chakra in that moment, which allows him just to summon Just look at the scan. Just look at the scan. This is after the mental end scene that you're talking about. Okay, okay that's it, fine. Yeah. I already so, explained darn, I that. I all my chakra those doppelgangers just now. I already spoke on it. <laughs> okay. That's fine. You're just gonna say he had the mental end, but just circular saying he has like some infinite level of chocolate. I'm, just I'm saying the mental has never That's stated to leave, and we know it's consistent that, that he wants to protect he Sasuke and Sakura. Yeah, so he would have not just infinitely giving him chocolate. He both he got the mental end, but he used it. Okay, I disagree. Okay, but that's what's stated. So what, what's your counter to... Okay, you can have that, that interpretation that, like, just because he lost the chakra, no, he couldn't gain it back. I'm not giving you an interpretation, Devon. I'm giving you the statement, mate. No, you're giving an interpretation. That's no, fine. I'm not. I'm reading what he said. Okay, and I'm saying that he just gets the mental... He gets the serious eyes. He has the mental amp. Okay, show me that he gained another mental amp. Huh? You already agreed it was the serious eyes. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that just always dictates he's just getting... You never clarified that, so I'm not about to show you. You already agreed. I'm not about hold to on, show you on. that. You never, hold on, all I agreed is that he had the eyes. You never said that means he got another amp. You what else would the that, serious eyes he, entail? All you, all you said is, does he have the serious eyes? Okay. What else would the serious eyes entail? He's hard. Uh, uh, that he's getting serious, what? Oh. Why would he... Okay. All right. Because when he gets the mental amp, he gets this huge wave of chakra, it's stated. So why okay, and he gets he more chakra right than and he summons Game of Bunta. That's fine. Okay, show me that he got more talker again. How the hell did he summon Game of Bunta? Uh, I already gave an, another explanation for They don't show, they don't so state something anything about the Nine Tails in that scene, so I want to Okay, yeah, they don't state it. They also don't state that he's using his own chakra. Do both of that point doesn't help you. Because we only know he's either using either his own chakra. chakra. They don't state either or, but mine's more consistent with the series and Nar- what we know to be Naruto's limits. Okay, I already gave my contentions. It's not really okay, much more so I can sure. say. Okay. Yeah, I, I'm not like, yeah, yeah, like all these points keep falling back to like the same circle of what you think. <laughs> yeah, we keep uh, getting like, back to like repeating keep... ourselves. So we can just like, yeah, like, yeah, it's fine. It's like, we can just conclude now. I don't think there's anything to back up the point once again. Okay, I'm pretty sure like everyone heard my points. I don't think I got to repeat it. So if you want to conclude, okay, uh, I'll just like start and say, like, for, like, I'll just start going over this point first. This is like the last one. I don't think it's like my, like, my, or my the explanation that I gave. Right, for Naruto using Kawama's chakra here, right? Because that's the only way shown that he knows how to summon Gamma Bunta, right? That's the only way he was taught to use summoning Jutsu. Right? He doesn't know about it, like, he doesn't know how to do it otherwise. Also, asked him to show that Naruto would be able to use summoning or shown to use summoning without tapping into Kawama's chakra. That's the only thing he's taught by Jiraiya. He again avoided that, for, like, avoided sending anything for that. So I don't even think he can show that Naruto has the capabilities to do something, to do a summoning without accessing Kawama's chakra. But that's all that stated Jiraiya, like stated by Jiraiya, that's how he's taught him. Then we also know that when Gamma went to the summit, they don't make it like an exact state, like they don't say the words that he's used to Karama Chakra or show the chakra, right? He does have a, converse, a conversation with uh, Karama prior to this showing that he did access it, right? That's all. They don't have to reference it, like they don't have to show a whole conversation each and every time, right? We just know that without Karama Chakra, he stated to not be able to do this, right? He's, not, he's incapable of doing this. While yes, he does get a mental amp, but if he summoned it with that mental amp, I'd be able to agree. But it's stated he gets the mental amp, he gets all this new chakra, and he uses all of that chakra. So that chakra is gone, they just got from the mental amp. And all we've done is repeat the same point, they should have another mental amp, they should still have the mental amp, with nothing to support it. I'm not disagreeing that he ever got a mental amp, I'm just disagreeing that he still has the, like... Uh, I'm muted, I'm, I'm at the chakra gain from it, right? So while he shouldn't have that chakra anymore, he summons Karama to um uh bring up Gamabuta. Then it's still stated again later that he still has no chakra by Gamabuta. Gamabuta states that him and Naruto have no more chakra at this point, which I referenced earlier. But uh, I guess we like never went into that one. So like it's stated once again whenever he's like reacting to Shikaku arms that he still has no chakra. So again, this Naruto at like at two two separate points is still stated to have no chakra. It still has the same feat that I gave earlier. It's Wait, hold on. You never showed Gamabuta stating that Naruto and him don't have chakra. You never asked me for it. You never, you never stated it. <laughs> yes, I did. That was the first thing I said. I said he, I said Gamabuta states that him and Naruto are out of chakra. That's the first thing I brought up. 
I don't know. Yeah, but it's my fault. Okay, something's gonna be to be stated out of talking. You can go into your recording. I know I said that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Then there's that thing, but like, even if we don't consider it until he gets it out of recording, I still think that's substantiated enough that this meant that this um, summoning of Gamabuta comes from the Nine Tails. Just because they don't state it doesn't mean that like it can't be coming from the Nine Tails because they also don't state it's coming from his own power. But we'll go with, with my explanation of it because it's more consistent with the series for how Naruto brings in the summonings. So it's based off of that. I don't think we like add any like uh, I don't know. I basically agree that they can both like damage and kill each other. Whoever wants to speed scaling will win. He like basically doesn't disagree with like Neji. He didn't disagree with Neji over Lee. He just thinks he like scale or like Neji above Lee. He, he scales Sasuke above Lee as well. I understand why? Um, the whole scaling for like Sasuke above Lee was like Gar reacting to Sasuke or like Gar like. Sasuke like blitzing Gara's sand. I showed that Gara's sand isn't even in movement here or to defend him because of the fact that Sasuke is like you or because of the fact that Gara is like literally moving the sand himself. And I explained why that way he wouldn't be able to like move the sand and the sand be able to move itself. Because then to be able to cross it, it'd have to cross like the distance that Gara put it to and come all the way back to block Sasuke, which may, which wouldn't make any sense. And also we showed, I showed that Gara is making, like is contr in control of the sand. Right. Another reason for why it shouldn't be able to move because Gar is controlling it. It can't move itself and Gar control it at the same time. It wouldn't make any sense. Right. And the, the, what I gave to show that Gar is controlling it is because Gar is morphing it into these different things and using it to attack. When it stated the automatic sand is solely for defense. So I showed that Gar is controlling its movements and why the sand shouldn't be able to move on its own. And it's also not shown to be, on the, be able to move on its own at this point. Either way, he also never showed like Gar reacted to an actual or, or, like attack from Lee, where I can show Gar reacting to attacks from Sasuke. Right, so I showed him like Lee's like at the very least his combat speed should be above his movement. He can never explain why, why those two things would be equal, right? Because it was his proof, uh, or it's like he was bringing up that they should be like Sasuke should be above based off of this. He'd have to be the one to prove that like these two speeds are equal, and I explained that as well. So, so, so since he couldn't prove that, they would at the most be relative to each other while Neji just stated above. So Neji just like basically like speed blitz and just beats up Sasuke. Okay. Let me get it? Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs>